Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to the Dice Tower. I am Mike Delisio. I'm Roy Kennedy. I'm Chris Yee. And I'm Justin Jacobson from Restoration Games. Ooh. Hello. Yes, <laughs> Justin is here to show us how to play this very, very spectacular looking game that you see before you. This is Return to Dark Tower, Justin. I think people are a little bit excited about this game. Uh, yeah, I've been working on it so long, I feel like it came out like 17 years ago, but <laughs> I, I keep forgetting people haven't uh, had a chance to get a good look at it yet, so I'm excited to show it to everybody today. So with your tutelage, you're guaranteeing that we're going to win this because you're so experienced with the game? Uh, no. In fact, <laughs> I, I've set it up so that you will probably lose horribly. Wow. That's good to know. <laughs> We will play on gritty mode. I'll I'll describe that. Uh, gritty uh, mode. Gritty mode. We're gonna play. All gritty right. Mode. All right. I well. prefer nitty, personally. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's because you're an iconoclast, Chris. Justin, why don't you uh, give us a little bit of an overview of what this game's all about and and how we're going to die in spectacular fashion in sure. front of everybody here. Uh, so. By way of background, the original game, Dark Tower, came out in 1982, had a big electronic tower in the middle that had all kinds of a uh, little light show and uh, sounds and all kinds of fun stuff like that, and uh, had a little microchip in it that today would look pretty comical. Mm -hmm. so, <laughs> so you're saying this baby runs on diesel now. Exactly, right. <laughs> cool. um, and so, uh, obviously, what we do at Restoration Games is we take old games and modernize them and bring them back, and that's what we did with Return to Dark Tower. It should be coming out uh, later this year. Backers will start getting them uh, later uh, uh, this year, and then uh, wherever it shows up after that, who knows? So, uh, yeah, so the feature of the game, of course, is the, the big electronic tower in the middle. Uh, took We have a team of, like, four, five, six engineers mm. who have been working on this thing, plus sound engineers. We have an app developer and all this stuff, and uh, so we're ready to start showing it off. That's fantastic. Awesome. All right, well, how does the game play? Well, let's, let's give an overview and, and find out how this game works. Sure. Uh, so first of all, the thing important to know is it's cooperative. Uh, the original was competitive. There is a competitive mode that you can play, mm. but uh, the primary mode is cooperative. So you're all going to win or lose together. And you can win by the, basically there's an adversary who has taken up residence in this uh, long mm. dormant tower. I like to call him Chris. Yeah, there's uh, a number <laughs> of different adversaries you can choose from. We're going to be playing with Ash Strider today. Oh, and gotcha. uh, so that's the adversary. And you mm. can defeat the adversary by drawing them out of the tower and then defeating them in battle. You okay. can lose in three different ways. Either you take too long mm -hmm. at the end of six months, which is a number of rounds. Each round is a month. And then at the end of six months, if you haven't defeated the adversary, you all lose. Okay. You can also lose if we have these beautiful skulls. At the end of every turn, mm. you're going to drop a skull into the tower. We'll see what that does. That's always a fun moment. We'll see uh -oh. what that does. Fantastic. But if you <laughs> ever need to drop in the skull and the supply is empty, then mm -hmm. you've lost the game. That means too much corruption on the board, too much chaos going around. Sounds like bad times. Yeah, exactly. And then uh, the last way is if you'll see you have spots on your player board for corruptions. Mm. Those are things if you, uh, through battle or events or things like that, obviously the enemy is trying to throw mm. a bunch of bad events and things at you. Sure. And you'll be losing warriors and spirit and things like that. If you ever need to lose something and don't have enough of it to lose to satisfy the requirement, you gain a corruption. Mm. which uh, has a negative effect on you, but also fills up one of those slots. If any hero would ever gain their third corruption, you all lose the game. Uh, that's right. what I plan to do two rounds into the game. There Fantastic. is no traitor mechanic. Why are you so clear. corrupt, Chris? <laughs> Calm yeah. down. One, one way to win, several ways to lose. Yeah. It's supposed Fantastic. to be purifying everything. Mm. So uh, basically, it's an app-enabled game, and we're, it doesn't look like it's doing too well over there as far as the update goes. But uh, uh, what, what's going to happen is on your turn, very simple is the, on the player board, it sort of goes through the turn. Mm -hmm. On your turn, you're going to start with your banner action. Mm -hmm. Each of you is playing a different hero and has a different banner action. So, Roy, you're playing the Relic Hunter. I can gain a potion. Yeah, he's like our sort of Indiana Jones. He goes around, he collects treasures, things nice. like that. Fantastic. Uh, you're playing the Spy Master, Mike. Yes. Uh, I can place my hero on any space in my current kingdom. And mm -hmm. you're playing the Brutal Warlord. Every he likes to throw people at the tr people at the problem. So at the start of every round, I get five uh, warriors. warrior yep. followers, right? Oh. So those are warriors. This is spirit. That's sort of like the uh, these are the two main currencies in the game. Okay. So then once you do that, then you're going to be doing you're going to move around uh, the kingdom mm -hmm. and uh, taking a heroic action and a reinforce action. You can mix those up. You can do them in any order. You can move a little, then uh, fight, then move some more, then do a reinforce, whatever it might be. Uh, and 
the, so the three acts, of, sorry, when you go to move, mm -hmm. before you decide to move, you can spend one spirit to double your move. Ah, uh, gotcha. If you need to get somewhere across the board, that's a, a good way to do it. Mm -hmm. uh, the heroic actions, there's three. You can cleanse, you can battle, or you can quest. Nice. Now cleansing, you'll see, I've already set this up, depending on the uh, mode and the adversary you're playing, the skull setup will be different, but I know based on what we're planning on playing today that it's one skull on every uh, building. It's a lot of skulls. Everything of, is corrupt. A lot of skulls. So uh, cleansing is basically if you're in a space with a building that has a skull on it, at mm -hmm. least one skull, you can cleanse to remove all the skulls on that building. And they go back to the supply. So that's one obviously good way to make sure you uh, have skulls on the supply. Then the other thing you can do is battle. We're going to have all these foes on the board. Uh, we have, uh, they're level two, three, four, and five. Uh, five is the adversary, that's the Ash Strider. Mm. These will come out at various points during the game, including at the beginning. Uh, the way you get them off the board principally is by battling them. You go into battle, mm -hmm. you're going to basically take losses. That's done through the app. And then you defeat them and you take the foe off the board. All right. And then the last thing you can do is quest. Uh, there's going to be quests. There's uh, the main objective, which is determined by, uh, we'll see at the beginning of the game, you're going to choose one ally to serve as your, uh, one companion to serve as your main ally, and they're going to give you an objective, and that's completing that objective is how you draw the adversary out of the tower. Mm. Uh, so we're going to have that main objective that can be completed any time you meet the requirements for it. Obviously, okay. it's usually pretty difficult to start. Sure. And then each month, there are two other quests. There's a ally quest and an adversary quest. Uh, the adversary, Ash Rider, is doing stuff during the game too, trying to make your lives difficult. So there'll be something that's gonna happen and you can go quest there to prevent the bad thing from happening. Mm. The ally quest is usually something good. You, generally speaking, it's uh, being able to recruit another companion or to gain a quest item that might be helpful for uh, the particular objective that you have. And again, you would go to that place do that uh, thing, and then uh, use the, using the quest action, and then get the results of that quest. Gotcha. Whatever uh, heroic action you choose, when you're done with your heroic action, you're going to gain two spirit. Nice. I like it. Yeah. Hmm. Are you supposed to have seven warriors? To yeah, you are supposed to have seven warriors. Where's Look, we warriors? need all the help we can get, Roy. Warrior it up. Now, I see out of the corner of my eye that your iPad appears to be updated. So I'm it did update. Hopeful. It did. Oh, wow. Okay. I am hopeful that we're going <laughs> to be exciting. ready to, to rock and roll with our with all our right. uh, Woo, app Crisis here. averted. <laughs> yes. All right. Uh, let me go ahead and start getting that ready. Uh, while I finish time, the last thing you're going to do, or this, the second action you can take during your turn is reinforce. Mm. Again, that can be done in any order. That's fine, obviously. Reinforce is where you're gaining resources. And okay. you'll see there's four different types of buildings uh, in each kingdom. Okay. So these are the four kingdoms. They're divided by rivers. There's the South Kingdom, West Kingdom, and so forth. All right. Uh, the four different types of buildings are identified here and by their shape. There's a citadel that's sort of like home base. Gotcha. Your sanctuary, that's like, you know, a temple where you can gain spirit. Village where there are warriors. And the bazaar where you can gain treasures and gear. Nice. If you look on your reinforce action, at each building there's a distinct reinforce action. And you can always take a free action there mm -hmm. and get whatever that uh, describes. Or you can spend spirit to gain the upgraded action. You can't do both. Mm. Ah, right. It's either or. Okay. Yeah. And then again, once you're done with your heroic action, you're moving your reinforce. At the end of your turn, that's when you're going to take a skull, drop it in the tower, and uh, usually events will happen. It Does might anything good the... ever happen from dropping a skull in the tower, Justin? That's the question that everyone Technically, wants... yes. Oh. Just like in real could, life. Could when, neutral uh, things happen, or is it just... Uh, so it's generally bad. There are a couple <laughs> of... So there's good events from the companions, and okay. there's, uh, you know, so good things can happen, mm -hmm. uh, but generally speaking, no. It's, it's is there an instant like, win they, skull hidden no. in that? No. It's no they lot, didn't no name lotto. it Nice Tower. <laughs> they named true. it Dark Tower. All right. right. Just for the benefit of people watching, is this pretty much a finalized version? So what they're seeing here is what they will hopefully eventually be getting? Yep. All the physical components are... Uh, basically as they would have the, oh, the nice. final product yeah great exactly great, great, great. Um, the app and i want to make this very clear <laughs> is still a work in progress we uh, digitally we have a lot more time to work on that so people oh, awesome. get their games sure uh so you're going to see when we when we see the app uh for example it's not optimized for ipad orient uh you know dimensions sure. so gotcha. like some of the graphics will be a lot, little off a lot of the text on stuff is stuff we're just sort of we put in as placeholders because mm -hmm. we're playtesting numbers and things like that. We're not so much worried about flavor text and things like that sure. right now. Very so cool. some of them might be a little clunky, right. uh, but it all works. Um, and I will, I will add though, there is always a chance we could have a bug, a crash, something like that. 
it's a work in progress. We've been testing it super hard, uh, so I uh, don't Hope it's expect all that bugs to in our favor. Like yeah, you get correct. a ton of spirit. Just for the record, a crash counts as a loss. I mean, that's oh, just, what? That's Whoa. Just Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> another loss condition, Chris. Just, yeah. Justin's like, let's play on super epically hard mode. <laughs> So importantly, I want to talk about uh, just uh, two more little features here. One is you have these uh, virtues here, all mm -hmm. right? And you'll see that some of them are printed on the board. You get those to start with. Mm -hmm. One of those is based on uh, you're the champion of your kingdom, wherever you mm -hmm. happen to start. That gives you advantages I'll talk about in a second. And then you have three that are locked. Those you can unlock by spending five spirit at your citadel. Mm -hmm. And then you flip it over and you immediately gain the use of those special abilities. It's like leveling up, right? Oh, nice. Uh, then the other thing I want to talk about are the different types of items real quickly. There's potions. You get one of those at the start of every turn. Yes. Those are one-use items. You spend them, gain the effect. Whenever you spend it, it goes to the bottom of the potion deck. We have a market of treasures here. Those are obviously pretty powerful. Uh, there's always three out at a time. When you take one at the end of, after you gain one, generally through the reinforce action, you'll replenish it with the top of the uh, treasure deck. And then we have uh, these gear cards, which are more modest effects, but mm -hmm. they're obviously what you can get for the free reinforce action at the bazaar. Got it. Um, three of them will give you advantages. Again, I'll talk about one second. And then three of them will give you a special ability. Maps let you move uh, one extra. Armor reduces your warrior losses. And Blessed Scepters let you remove skulls. Cool. So the other big feature of the game that I want to talk about last thing is advantages. That's sort of the crux of the mechanics, mm. right? So you'll see you all start with uh, one basic advantage, and anytime you see that little arrow up symbol, that's the advantage symbol. Okay. Mm. Black, uh, when, when it's dark black or gray there, mm. that means it's uh, always on. And then some of them you'll see, we don't have any out right now, but some of them will be conditional. It's like a light gray, okay. which means you might have to spend something to uh, gain that advantage, for example. But it's pretty self-explanatory. Gotcha. Uh, oh yeah, there we go. We have. I forgot the. If uh, you double one. your move, you gain. Right. A, okay, got it. So he's like that. Can if he unlocks that virtue, he would be able to use that. That's like oh, him nice. charging into battle. If he doubles his move and runs into battle with somebody, he gets that uh, adv extra advantage. All right. So the way advantages work, we'll talk about when we actually get into a battle request. But th that's what you use. Uh, to battle uh, or to improve your cards to delve dungeons. There's going to be dungeons that might pop up on the game in the game, and you, mm -hmm. when you go to delve into a dungeon, you use advantages there. Gotcha. And then you can also use them sometimes to complete quests. Like okay, cool. Probably ready to start. No, let's make let's it happen. Guys, ready? All right. Justin, like you've done this so a first, time or two. Yeah. So first things first. Oh. Uh, the anticipation. Let's, let's do. Let's let's start the app first. Okay. Uh, and uh, does it matter where I? Like, should I position it so anyone can see it, or? Oh, is the connection coming through? Is it coming through? Uh, let's find that. I just started it. So. We're just checking to see if we can get this coming through. We may end up showing it on my board. We'll see how it goes here. If we nope. can get a direct connection, or yeah, yeah. or just through it. a camera. Okay, so we can just set it here okay. when you need to show something. Yeah, when you want to show something uh, specific. Sure. Well, for setup, it probably makes sense. So go yeah. ahead and let's go ahead first do, and then yeah. That doesn't need to be plugged in, right? If we're not uh, gonna. Yeah, do you know what? That's yeah. true. I had, it should be 100. As as so that's fine. All right, and I also I don't know if it's the smudges are a problem, but you can feel free to wipe it down. No, just I'm not worried button. about that. All right, so we're going to go ahead and start a new game. Okay. If you click that start a new game button there. Do you own a tower? Uh, I do. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> not just any tower. Hit yes. All right, here we go. Turn on the tower. Oh! It's making noises. I hear action. Oh. I just realized one thing. So. <laughs> Ash Strider thinks he can scare us with the whirrings of gears. He's wrong. So it's uh, this is how it's subscribing. This is a Bluetooth connected oh, okay. Bluetooth connection. And I just realized though, let me check. I think no, I don't know why I'm not getting any sounds out of it. Oh, it's because the volume was all the way down. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's always the last thing you expect. Mm. All right, so you missed the uh, delightful intro music. Okay. <laughs> but now we have some foreboding violins. Ooh, All right, nice. so we're going to choose cooperative mode. We're going to choose gritty mode because you guys are ser experienced <laughs> gamers. <laughs> I don't so think you know who he's no talking problem to. there. Yeah. Yeah. Casual gamers? Hit continue. All right. Three players. All right. And you can hit continue. All right, so we're going to choose who our uh, uh, ally is, our co co companion for this. Okay. And so that determines what the main objective is. And you'll see there's a... Uh, a whole oh, wow. bunch of them. Oh, wow. That's All with different objectives. They look really cool. So we're going to choose Zeta the Afrit. Oh, my goodness. Okay. And why Ooh. don't you read that out for everybody? 
Recover. Is it Azkol? Azkol, yeah. And recover Azkol's treasures. The treasures of Azkol, the Sorcerer King, can be harnessed by the Virtuous to draw the adversary from the tower. Bring them to Zyda's... Zyda? Yeah. Sure. <laughs> Zyda's Sanctum, and they will complete the ritual. <laughs> the ritual. So, right. uh, I think I say Zeta, actually. Zeta. Zeta, Zeta. Zeta Freet is uh, one of the companions that we have, and... Uh, We'll see who's going to get that in a second, but go ahead. We're going to select that. And All then right. we select an adversary. Okay, and there are and, multiples, uh, but we're going to stick with yeah. Ash, Ash Strider here, yeah. yes? So... Uh, Ash, importantly, all oh, those what? adversaries play very differently. So okay. that's one of the main ways you're going to... So the ally is going to determine what your objective is in the game, which can be very different, whether it's getting a bunch of warriors or you know delving three dungeons or whatever it is. Mm -hmm. And then the adversary determines like all the sort of negative stuff that goes on the board. Gotcha. Ash Rider, fire, basically. So it's fire and chaos, Jason. Let's not forget chaos. Yeah. Why did I call you Jason, You do Justin? it all the time. It's I right. do it's, call it's you Jason all, right, all the time. It's, <laughs> it's Jason on the brain. It's tradition. It adds skulls to buildings and can even set the rivers on fire. You will need the River of Fire tokens for this Oh, game. yeah, I forgot to get those oh, out. River, river of if Fire If it happens, tokens. we'll get them out. We, okay. we can get them out. If now. it happens? If. I would like there to not be as much fire as possible. Be. That's encouraging. I like the fact that it could not happen. All right, All right. here we go. Select. Yep. All right. So then, like I mentioned, there's a number of level two foes, three foes, four foes, and then the adversary we already picked. So for our level two foes, there's the four different types. We're going to choose brigands. So just go ahead and tap on brigands. All right. Oh. All yeah. right. So each adversary, each foe has a different. So click on number three there, and we're going to choose our level three foe. We're going to choose frost trolls. Frost trolls. Okay. My goodness. All right. Continue. And then uh, no, I'm going to choose our level four foe. We're oh. going to go with the classic dragon. So ah. I so like you can it. hear some of the sound like effects. Like they should be able to pick it up through my mic, I would think. Yeah, yeah. So you can hit continue now. Okay. Uh, and this is the sort of the confirmation for the game setup. You've mm -hmm. chosen cooperative. We've chosen gritty. We've got our adversary, our uh, ally, and our three foes. We're all set to go. So let's start it up. All right. Now the tower is making noises. The tower is making noises. Okay, so, right, so this is part of setup, and uh, part of that is the skull placement. And that's going to change based on whether you're in gritty mode or regular mode. Sometimes it can vary by other things, but mm -hmm. in this case, because so we're in gritty mode, it's one skull in every building, which I've already done, so you can continue. Gotcha. All right, we didn't choose who the first player was. Who wants to be the first player? Roy. All right, Roy, you I get Zeta the I guess I'm the Afrit. first player. So Woo you get Zeta the Afri. Uh, Zeta. And if you see, so uh, they have a, a special ability that you get to use uh, as if, you know, we were your own. So go Spin ahead and continue there. Treasure to gain three Ooh. wild advantages. All right, All right so nice. now we're going to be putting out our foes. This, we're spawning our foes. So this, uh, the app will tell you so where it is on the map. It's in the Northern Kingdom. Brigands are spawning in the north in Five Pines. Oh, so go ahead there. and put that over there. Mm. And uh, you can click next. In the west, in the plains of Waldra, right here. Oh, those guys are going down. Brutal warlord time. Bone Hills. In the south. It's the beautiful this time of year. Have you been to Bone Hills lately? It's gorgeous. The boobies <laughs> are fantastic. <laughs> the ribs are good. <laughs> they are good. And uh, Frost Trolls. Oh, I get the big sister. In the big sister. I get the level, big big sister. Big I get the level of course. There you are. All right. Enjoy that, Roy. I think that's probably it to start. Okay, so this is sort of our main screen when you're in the game. Okay. It'll have a summary mm -hmm. of everything that's uh, the uh, adventures that are happening. And you know what? I totally forgot to double check where this spawned. So this is quest in the peaks of the Jinn in the north. So that is our main. Uh, can you put that on the peaks of the Jinn over there in the north? Right. So right. next to the river About there. The yeah. Peaks of the right. Jinn. <laughs> so we want to go back. Um, so that's where our main objective is. So okay. And gotcha. We didn't, uh, right I don't know if we read it, but me. the main objective is to quest there mm -hmm. when you have four of Azkal's treasures and five virtues. So someone has to have four of the treasures and five virtues. Oh, wow. We actually have, or got lucky. Mm -hmm. We have one of Azkal's treasures in the market right now. Oh. So we can get a leg like, on that. I keep saying we like I'm playing. I don't yeah. care if you guys. So if I were to, <laughs> if I were to hit hold to complete, we win right now. Yeah, you, that is true. That is no, that is the cheat mode. There you go. Um, it's a right. good feature, by the way, so you don't accidentally tap it. Yeah, it's yeah. Hold to press down a hold. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, so then you'll see the bottom buttons. There is the battle button. That middle button is the dungeon button, and then the one on the right there is the tower status button. If uh, the game status button, uh, okay. you can see like how many foes are on the board, what their current events are, things like that. 
So importantly, in month one, this is the break, guys. This is gotcha. your moment of calm. Okay. No events will happen. There's no quest you have to worry about. This is your mm. free chance to do the it's a sort of like the gear up, right? Do you uh -huh. want to go fight something and get you know some spoils of war? Do you want to do some cleansing? Whatever it might be. Okay. So we're going to start with uh, Roy, and I can probably take the app you right now it, while sir. you're playing. And I'll just put that over there. So Roy. So at the start of my turn, first. I'm yes. going to gain a potion. So you draw the top so part I of the potion. So I get a potion. Yep. Straight up, get a potion. I am the relic hunter. There so are six different I'm potions. Potion. Which one did you get there? I got the potion of the siren song. So I can spend to move any foe two spaces. So I can move foes closer to me. Right. Or this importantly, is how that works. you can put them wherever. It's fine. Importantly, you'll notice uh, your champion virtue gives you advantages on a certain terrain. So in your case, it's in the hills because you're mm, the so champion of the east. So for example, these uh, frost troll is right now in a mountain. That's not as good for you. You're supposed you to could, gear up. What's that? I'm told that you're supposed to gear up, whatever that means. Gear, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So th that's what we're doing. Like, the month one is your chance to gear up. Yes, exactly. I thought, I thought I messed something up. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You know, gearing up is... Month one is like... Uh, Brian. No, that's fine. That's fine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's one of the developers, Brian. Ah, okay. Uh, gotcha. So, yeah. So this is your chance to get some gear, whatever. You can get gear by doing a reinforce, but you can also get stuff if you have enough advantages when you battle people. Mm -hmm. So you could use that advantage to slide the frost troll into the hills, giving you two extra advantages. Not that I'm telling what you did to do. So, is this three kind of like a number that I need to try to get close to? So, or? Yeah, so generally speaking, if you go into a battle with a foe and you have a number of advantages equal to their level, you should not gain a corruption. Mm. That is, you should be able to pay for all the losses. You won't necessarily do well enough to get something good, but well, you should avoid a corruption. Not always, though. That is kind of interesting because he is a the troll is a humanoid, which that's I right. have advantage against that because I am precise. And also, I am a champion of the east, so I have wild plus two wild advantages in the hills. Correct. So if I move over to the sanctuary, I could bring him in and take him out. What is this guy going to do if I don't, if he's around? Is he going to come towards me and attack me? So, or? importantly, you do need to keep the foes sort of under control. You don't mm -hmm. necessarily need to eliminate them. There's no specific ones you need to defeat. It's very oh, mad dear. at me. He didn't like us waiting. Whoa. They didn't like us waiting too no, long. That not. can happen from time to time. Sorry All about right. that. Sorry about that. <laughs> um, yeah, so basically, <laughs> the longer <laughs> the foes stay on the board, they level up and they get harder and harder, and their events hit harder and harder, and they start their events start hitting broader. Mm. So you don't want to leave them out and completely ignore them. Yeah, well, I'm going to move. Safe. So before you move, just real quick, I want you to keep in mind you also have a reinforce action, so you want to think about. Uh, oh, I could do one of these. So I'm currently at a Citadel. Correct. I could gain a free potion. Um, or I could spend five to gain a virtue, which I do not you don't have. have. We have one. So you could also you could spend your spirit to double your move if you wanted to like hit a uh, bazaar before you got there or something like that. I'm not saying you sanctuary. have to do it, but it, you sort of want to plan out what you're going to do. do. These, sanctuary uh, lets do these me help gain you in battle. This as well. Those are the losses you're going to take basically. Got it. Yeah, well, most of the time, spirit, warriors, items, things like that. Okay. So. I can go to, can you do it in any order as far yeah. as the move yep. or the, so I can go here and get more spirit, Yep. or I could stay here and get a potion, but I'm getting potions for free all the time anyway. Uh, I think spirit might be harder for me to get, so I'm actually going to well, go one, two, Keep in mind here. you get two spirit every time you do a heroic action, but cool. yeah, that's fine. If you I have to get to four to start unlocking, or five, five to start yeah, unlocking exactly. these. So if you want to start building towards a virtue, that's certainly something you can do. Oh, is it like crackling or? I think so. Well, I'll try to make sure it doesn't. Are we move. sure it's not the tower? <laughs> the tower was very you know, angry with our listen, inactivity. It can yes. happen. Let All me right. know if it breaks up more. Um, I'll try to move less. Um, so I'm going to do that um, to move there, and then I'm going to gain a spirit with the reinforce action. Okay. Um, and then I'm going to use my potion of strength to spin to move any foe two spaces. When you spin a potion, it goes on the bottom of the deck, just straight okay, onto cool. the bottom. Yep. So this goes here. Yep. And then I will move him into okay. the hills, so that way I have a little bit better chance of fighting him. Leave it to Roy to battle, turn one. I like it, sir. All right. I, I was tempted into doing it. So you're going to hit that <laughs> battle button with the sword there? I want you to do it, Roy. It's battle, battle button with the sword. Just watch your mistaps there, buddy. Mm -hmm. Choose a frost, frost troll. Yeah. And you have three advantages, is that? Oops. Yes, I have the humanoid okay. and then in the hills. Good, all right, so hit that fight button at the bottom. Okay. 
And what happens is it's, each uh, foe has a deck of 10 cards. Mm. And when I say the foes can level up if you don't do them, the, the cards actually digitally get harder. Oh, and gotcha. then what you're doing when you're spending advantages is you're de-leveling them. So right now they're at the middle level. Mm. Right? They're okay. They're ready. Mm -hmm. As you de-level them, they actually get better and better. So go ahead. You're, it's a level three foe, which means you pick three cards. So just tap any three gotcha. of those cards. What will my advantages do for me? I'm going to show you okay. right now. So three. Oh, you picked those three, huh, Roy? All right, oh. so now it's going to reveal the first card. And the first card oh. tells you what your losses are. Lose seven oh, warriors and two spirit. Now, I'll tell you right now, that is the... I'm pretty sure if I remember correctly, that's the Frost Fucking Trolls really crit bad. card. That's like the that's worst awful. card. <laughs> yeah, I don't want that. So, uh, the, objectively, though, you actually can't afford to lose that right. without gaining corruption. But you that have advantages expensive. to spend. So go ahead. The way you do that is you tap the advantage button on the card. Oh, the, the arrow button there. there. Yep. And now it went to five warriors and one spirit. You can spend another advantage or you can move to the next card. Keep in mind you have two more cards you have to resolve. <laughs> Um, I'm no longer allowed to spend advantages on no, this one. No, you can spend another one. You, you, you have three advantages total to spend. You've spent one so far. Oh, but I could... You can spend them I on... I can't spend them on this card if I reveal the next card. Right. You can never go back. You have to resolve each card in order. I'm which is to, one of the big changes, by the way, from earlier. I'm going iteration. to do this again, Okay. Then. So now it's just lose three warriors. And I can no longer advan do advantages on Because it looks Correct. like it's down to the bottom. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Okay, okay. Uh, well, first things first, you have to resolve the card. So pay for your three warriors. Okay, okay. Make change there with your five. And then hit the continue button. Confirm button, sorry. Ooh. <laughs> now I have to lose five, which I cannot do. So I'm going to spend my third advantage okay. that I have on this. This is going well, Chris. So you can lose three warriors, and you have one more card you have to resolve. So that yep. seems okay. Remember that gear up idea? <laughs> I like no. it. I don't and know. then go one more here. And what is that one? One gear or five warriors. All right, you don't have either of those, and you have what? One more advantage, right? What did, no, you use no three. Advantage. You I advantage. Three. So you can't afford to pay for that card. So surprise, surprise! Our very first battle, we're going to get a corruption. It's That's not the fantastic. end of the world. It's not the end of the world. One I think into a loss condition on turn how, one. How much were you involved you, in the programming? So of the to app? be clear, like I said, usually you're okay. You did hit the crit card, so this is your corruption. Crit card. So it has an effect. Listen, I'm now it. selfish. I no longer care what you guys think. I cannot give any other hero anything when I trade. All right. So I didn't mention this yet because it hasn't come up. But <laughs> if you're on the same space with another hero, you guys can freely trade anything except virtues. And corruptions. Except for Roy, because he's a jerk. Yeah, Roy, yeah, I'm not trading with you guys. Now, importantly, though, also, if you look at your reinforce action for the Sanctuary, you can spend five spirit to remove a corruption. Uh -huh. Oh, gotcha. Uh -huh. But here, it's not all bad. It's not all bad. So let's confirm that card. You did re resolve it. Mm -hmm. And so you defeated that uh, Frost Troll. Nice so job, he goes Roy. off the board, and you get two spirit. Mm, that's what I call it. Two spirit. Two spirit for doing the heroic action. So you're you know, not too far off from... Uh, Getting rid of that corruption you just got. <laughs> Great. <laughs> All right. One step away from, or two steps away from death. But All if right, that frost so troll had stayed on the board, it would be harder next time. Correct. Yeah, yeah. So, so importantly, it's into your ah, turn. Yes. Now it's time to. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and pop this out of here. I don't know why I left it in here for this. All right. You guys this is ready? exciting stuff. Are we ready for this? I'm going to drop the skull into the tower. Release the skull! Uh oh. Wait a minute. Wait, oh. wait, wait, wait. Oh, we turned it off. It didn't occur to me that that would disconnect it. We're still okay, yes? I think so, but let's find out. Dun, dun, dun. Go ahead. Skull Tower. Here we go. Skull, Skull Tower. Here we go. Skull Tower. All That's right, nothing ominous. happened. That's fine. <laughs> Very ominous. So, of course, nothing happens because it's month one, so I was building it up for mm -hmm. nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Go ahead. Thanks for that, Justin. Are we it's going a, in reverse? It's the calm before the storm. Are we doing in... in Winter Shins. That's... That's wild talk. <laughs> During Dark Tower? So we're going this way. I would go clockwise. It's up to you, but I would go clockwise. Okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Tempt the fates with the This was me trying to this was me trying to hold off that. hold off my uh, <laughs> my losing on turn 1. Correct. Turn uh, where's delay? the rock? I, I need I'm going to be defeated by a rock. Okay. So the first thing I can do is I can put my hero anywhere I want in my current kingdom. Correct. Woo, Chris, anywhere. I I heard you the first time. I'm going in the tower. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I would like to gear up, because I, I assume the worst thing you can do on your first turn is to fight somebody, I believe. I've heard that. Jerks. Okay. Um, <laughs> let's get a gear, because I can do that for free, right? Let's go to the bazaar. How bizarre? How bizarre? Where is my bazaar? Right there. Yep. All right. Mm. So, so, 
There's six but, items in the bazaar. These three give advantages. Uh -huh. uh, and there's so there's. No, I have a st I have a stealth advantage already. What right. does that mean? So the br brigands happen to be a, have a stealth trait. So oh. that it would give you an advantage against them. So you already have one advantage. Now okay. they're not in the desert, which is your favorite. Terrain. Yeah, yeah. That's fine though. What you could do is you could get dusky cloaks, which also give a stealth advantage. That would give you two stealth advantages mm -hmm. equal to the level. It should be fine. Look, if there's anything I'm known for, it's how well I can pull off a dusty cloak. So I think that I'm gonna I'm gonna go for that. Now the other thing I want. Oh, oh I, okay. I Here almost for, no no that was you. Sorry, I thought you were playing the relic hunter. Ah. So important is your other virtue, by the way, which we didn't mention, Roy. You can get treasures for one spirit instead of two. Mm. Keep that in mind. Look at that. I might be going to the bazaar. That's then. my dusky cloak. Look at that. Yeah. Here, I like me, to pair that with my here. dusky shoes. And a nice Chablis. Oh, man. <laughs> More of a dusky boots. Moving around, man. All right, we're moving things. Okay. We good? It is dusky. All right. All right. Okay. So uh, that was just my first thing was my banner. So now I can still move. Oh, well, you did your reinforce, too. I didn't. Oh, I did do my reinforce. Yes, yeah, sorry. Gosh, I mean. Go for it. I have, really? I feel yeah. like this is a red herring. I'm moving into the Bone Hills. I'm sure it's not called that because people die there. I what? think Justin is trying to give us bad advice. I think that to might see be true. how how fast. Okay, the game so let's can figure out us. how many advantages I have. I have two advantages. Correct. correct? That's it. That's it. But it's should just a be level fine. Two, is right? there a way I can warp him? It's into level two. You only have two cards to resolve. It should be not fine three. unless you get the crit card. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I'm not a big fan of that. Okay, here we go. So I'm going against the brigands. Yeah. Uh -huh. That's right. Okay, here we go. Mm-hmm. Okay, so, so here's, you're going to pick two cards. Here's what I like to do. Level two monster or enemy. Correct. Okay. Okay, I'm going to do this. Can I pick well, you, something? You no. missed. Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> All, to do. All right, here we go. Many say that the best. Lose to two warriors for each skull on or adjacent to your. Oh, All come right, so on. You Are you two. kidding me? So that would be four warriors, which you have. Though. I do you have, have four, but I have two advantages. Right, so here's the thing. One of the just. I'm just. Yeah. I'm not going to like guide you all the way through here, no. but just, uh, you know, first play here. Sure. One, you can certainly spend like one advantage, one advantage to mitigate your losses. But right. one of the things you can do is try and absorb a bigger loss so you can spend more advantages on a single card, to driving it to a positive result. So you oh. might actually gain something. So yeah. it's one of the ways you can gain stuff in battle. Yeah, you might lose four warriors, but on the next card you might be getting a gear or something. All right, well, or the next one could just not matter that much. All right, so I'm, I'm not going to spend any advantages okay. here. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to do this. I'm going to take one warrior back. All right, so, so then four. you can hit confirm. Confirm. Okay, lose one gear or five words. I don't really want to lose my gear. But you have two gear. advantages anyway, so no reason not to spend them on the last card. Gain a gear! See? Hey. That's what I'm talking about. That's how Gain it's done, gear. Roy. Wow. Did you well, also, <laughs> I fought a level three troll, and that he fought true. a just yeah. normal human. So I fought a brigand, and I walked so away. I stole its That brigand was like feeble. Brigands come off. You okay. gain two spirit for the heroic action, yeah, and then yeah. obviously you gain a gear. So we have these advantage ones, but then okay. there's also the trusted maps where your base move is plus one. Okay. Not, suit, not as helpful for you because no, you can teleport I already around. Move a lot, exactly. yeah. Leather armor, prevent up to two losses per battle card. Oh. And Blessed Scepters, whenever you reinforce in a building, you can also remove a skull from it. I do whatever it takes for the team. Man, that sounds good. And you're just over here just I like, gaining. I like clearing up skulls. Blessed it's like the Blessed Scepters. Scepter. Right. Yeah, yeah. That's so also for good, a selfish person to say, right? I should mention the fourth hero is the Orphan Scion in yes. the base game. We do have two more in the expansion. But in the base game, the other ones are Orphan Scion. Uh, she's very good at cleansing, so okay. you don't have that uh, ability we that. here. We need you to have cleanse. your own good things you're good at, but you're not extra good at cleansing if you All have right. weapons. Okay, so hmm. I kind of feel like uh, we saw two examples, yes. right? Two ends sure. of a continuum of a good sure. turn and a bad turn. Yeah, you could say it. And, and a bad turn. Right. Once your skull. again, you fight the baby monsters. I'll take out the heroic things because you're not strong enough. To I'm do about it. to drop a My skull. Galicio. Here we go. Just make sure it goes in. Don't make me go <laughs> selfish on you. Okay, nothing exciting. It's month one. All right, Love your it. turn, oh, Chris. That sound was pretty exciting, right. actually. First things first, banner action, get your five warriors. There banner you go. Banner time. Brutal Warlord. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I think that what I'd like to do is I'm going to cleanse the cleanse. space that I'm on. So I'm actually helping out the map, mm -hmm. unlike some of these other fellas. All right, so you get This two is a teamwork game, cleansing. right? Are we supposed to be tearing <laughs> each other down action. the entire time? Unlike like, I'm some not quite sure. It's, an, it's like Dirty Dozen. It's Correct. an uneasy truce. I, I think we're supposed to be working together, and Justin's just trying to wedge uh, in between us to make us <laughs> fight each other. Why? All right, so I'm going to move. He's the Dark Lord himself. I want to go to the... Ooh, I need to go to the village to get... 
uh, more people. I'm going to go to the bazaar. How bizarre. One, two. Now you can move across oh, rivers, so right? Now, that doesn't mean anything. Correct. Okay. Rivers, uh, they're, they're borders, so you yeah. can't move up or down the river unless you have a very special treasure. Mm. But, uh, so you have more than, you have two, you have three spirit now. So you have two spirit, which means you could buy one of the treasures. Oh. You could. Mm. could. Can I take a look at yeah, that? Absolutely. So. And one of those and one you of said those was particularly Ascol's good. Tre well, one of it's Ascol's treasures, which remember, you need to get four of his treasures as part of your main objective. Does does one person need all four of them? Or Yes. But that's it hard. Oh. Well, you can oh. trade. So you can Don't trade. forget. I you can. can. Well, I'm sure by the time there. you're ready to do that, you'll... But can he accept things from other people? Uh, yes, he just can't give anything. Got it. All right, so what's it, what's it to be, Chris? I'm going to get a gear. I'm going to keep my spirit. What? I, what? All right. You're, you're not getting one of these? Look, I'm jealous of those He wants to cloaks. unlock something. What, do you, what uh, virtue do you have your eye on? I can tell. What virtue do I have? Yeah, what are you saving up spirit for? If it's not to buy treasure or, uh, or uh, virtue. Oh, uh, sometimes you lose spirit. Sometimes, losses, but right? I'm going to give you my last little bit of advice uh -huh. as we end month one here. Yeah. You can't be timid. Go, you know, don't don't play cautious. Playing cautious could be difficult. You just called him timid. It, uh, and you know, you're playing the brutal yeah, warlord, it was, Chris. The timid. I'm brutal. the brutal warlord. I'm going to stay here. Did you get a corruption that made you timid It over was there? a quiet yes. turn. A quiet <laughs> turn. It's okay. It's that's, all right. That's a point. But point I get a third it. movement, right? Yes. You don't have yeah. to, but yeah, you can move. Oh, Set I'm, yourself up for next turn. I'm going to take it. Okay. And then you're going to drop a skull in the tower. And. Bada bit. Oh. Oh. So now the month has ended. No, oh, and it tells you that right there. Yeah. Okay, nice. So we're going to get new quests because okay. we're starting month two. So I don't know if we want to put this on sure. there. So as we mentioned, one of these is uh, the adversary quest. Mm -hmm. That is from the Ash Rider. And what does that one say? The Ash Rider. Ash Strider sends its agents to work spells that turn water to fire. You must stop them. Quest in three rivers and spend one spirit or Ash Strider will ignite the rivers. <laughs> Uh, okay, three rivers. Where is that Billy rivers? Joel's song? Oh, here it is, right here. Okay, River Roy, of fire. We're counting Class. on you. That's good. I want to go Although to the I could anyway. teleport here and go there if you need me to, but you're going first. It's okay. Quest there and, and spend what? Spend a spirit. Spirit, okay. That's easy. You got that, yeah, Roy. Easy, Come easy. on. Are we ready? Yep. Yeah. We don't want the rivers ignited, I think. I think, generally speaking, you want riv rivers to be fire free. I like water. I can't oh. drink fire. It's like Cleveland after the Indians. Were and then we have a, an ally quest. Recruit Le Letha? Letha? Letha. Letha. Letha the, Letha the Dryad. Senses fear among the creatures in the for of the forest. Aid her in calming them, and she will join you. Quest in Yellow Pike in the West Kingdom. And Woo! spend a wild advantage, two wild advantages, sorry, to gain Letha as a companion, Chris. Oh, I've nice. got wild advantages up the wazoo in the forest. That's true. That's perfect ah, for you. Ah, yes. All right. Okay, continue. Solve Yep, uh, and then that should be it. I thought it was gonna like literally. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> the, the tower says that is not it. <laughs> that is, it's letting you know that we're starting a new month. That's it's all. It's about Nothing to go into orbit. Um, so, is it supposed to terrify you? <laughs> so now we continue to go in order. Okay. Um, so we're gonna go back to right. You're gonna take mm -hmm. your banner action and right then figure out what you wanna do. Yeah. No, I will grab another every potion. Month, just one. No. Turn. So at this point, the number of months is determined. Uh, the number of uh, rounds is uh, varies mm -hmm. based on the number of players. Okay. Number potion of, turns based of, on the of dragon's of teeth. I can spend it to gain six warriors. Is there oh. any reason why I wouldn't just spend it now? Yeah. Like, there's no reason to spend it right now. And you might have something that says spend a potion to do something. And I could do this oh. in the middle of combat. Yeah, absolutely. And combat's normally when you're losing your warriors. Yep. Yeah. Well, uh, there's also events and things like that. Now you can't do it. During the end of the month, when the events are going off, that okay. it has oh, to be during. Oh, something your turn. might happen at the end that it makes yeah. you lose warriors. Okay. 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 So, I'm going to move to. I'm going to take my bizarre action, which I can spend one less because of my prepared here to gain a treasure. So I can spend one spirit to gain a treasure. Yep. And these are treasures. Yep. Nice. Including, like I said, Remember though, you can't this trade might that. not be the one that I want to get. Okay. Is there one that's... <laughs> when you cross the river, move to any space adjacent to the river. That's Are the you going to gain this one on your turn then? Uh, I probably should, right? Do I have enough? Two spirit. Yeah, I, I'm good. Yeah. yeah, I'll probably go ahead and grab that. Mm. Oh, this is wild advantages at, in lakes. Mm -hmm. This is plus one magic, magic advantage. advantage. Do so we don't mean? have, uh, so the, again, those are all traits. They did be on foes. Oh, see, uh, so, for example, uh, the Ash Strider, who's your final boss, is mm. a magic. 
uh, foe. Mm. So it would count for that. We'll take right. the and it lamp. can also be used in dungeons and completing some quests. Okay. We'll take a lamp of hope because this allows me to cleanse from anywhere. Okay. So that's really cool. The lamp of hope. Lamp there. of hope. And then we replenish that with uh, Tears of the Shadow. Mm. Oh, nice. An undead advantage there. I don't think we have any undead creatures in this uh, and lineup then, for this one, unfortunately. Okay. Um, I'm going to try to do the quest here. Okay, so that's the Ash Rider quest. Uh, we're going to go ahead and... I don't want We don't need to do rivers. this for everyone, but when they see first time completing a quest, yeah, so go. you're going to spend your spirit. I will spend a spirit. And then hold to complete. Do you want to do it? I want to do it. I'm charging it up. Chris, you can't see it, but it's really cool. Oh, it's it's fantastic. Yeah, oh, Rider did yeah. not like that. Man, I do like that little <laughs> da da da. That reminds me of something. So uh, you get two spirit for doing a heroic a action. Heroic action. And then um, you have uh, movement left, I think. Or um, I, I moved two. So you can move one more if you like. Uh, I don't know that. I you kind of want to start my turn in the bazaar, so I think I'm going to do that. Okay. So then. Drop a skull. Here we go. Well, and this, this, is, this is this is for death real. Death roulette right now. For oh, real. death roulette. I like the way that sounds. Ah, ah, the opposite. So you said we had said sometimes something good can happen. So in this case, Zeta, who's joined us, okay, has uh, their own event. In this case, Zeta finds what others have lost. The player Ooh. who is holding Zeta may gain the top card of the treasure deck. I that, like that, because really? having treasures is good, good, good. Look at Let's that. Let's see, I got the Lamp of Darkness You here. have the two lamps. You do, the Lamp of Hope and the Lamp of Darkness. Listen, you put them together and you get the together. Lamp of Adequacy. Mm -hmm. um, I can spend, spend to remove one foe from my space. Also, I get plus one beast advantage, so when I fight beasts, I'll be able to make their attacks worse. You're a beast. So we did also get a rumor. Oh. That's the first time we've had that. Those are basically warnings of future events. Ooh. <laughs> so in this case... Uh, that's a rumor about the Astrider. Fires gather in the tower. Spies say the fires will rain down on a citadel. So something's oh, going to happen so in a citadel somewhere. So if we stand on a citadel, we might get fire blasted. Maybe. Okay. Mm Depends what the effect is. You know, it's, it's a rumor. Very it's ominous. a rumor. All right. And that's it for your post-turn event. So it's your turn, Mike. Don't forget your banner action. Okay, my banner action is to move anywhere I want to. And so what I'm, I'm wanting to do is pick up uh, Ascal's horn, he, horn here. So to do that, I'm going to need to be in a bazaar, right? I may be selfish, but so I still want here. us to succeed. So that's your teleport, your banner. That's action. my mm -hmm. banner action. Right. Now I'm going to do my Ooh. reinforce action because so, when I do that, I actually am going to be able to remove. Yeah, that that's skull. good. Now one thing I haven't introduced yet uh -oh. is the haggle die. <laughs> Chris Don't knows all about it. Don't do so it. So when you go to reinforce anywhere, uh -huh. before you actually complete the reinforce action, you can roll the haggle die. Uh -huh. And whatever the result is, you'll get. So if it could be a free gear, oh. three extra warriors, oh. or a potion. Oh. There's also a blank side. And then there's also two sides uh, that say uh, bizarre closed. So... Uh, oh, if you roll man. that, then you cancel the reinforce action. Now, it doesn't sound like you want to do it because you're keen to get out yeah, of it. Yeah, but just I, keep that in mind when you reinforce. Okay. You can always roll the haggle die. So I'm, blank means no effect. No happens. effect. You Nordic. just do your reinforce. Yeah, well. I don't feel good about a one in three chance because I, I do want to use my blessed scepter. Okay. Oh, blessed. I dub thee sirloin of beef. Okay, uh, I'm going to reinforce here. I am going to remove this yep. with my scepter, and I'm going to purchase as calls. Horn for what is it? Uh, two spirits. Two spirits. There we go. Boom. Um, and now I, I still have a I still have a move and a heroic so action. Let's replenish this. Okay. We got the white cauldron there. Okay. Of Ascal, right? No. All right. right now. I'm gonna guess that everything is an Ascal treasure. I Do mean, not one spend spirit not. for glyphs facing you. That'll be something later. Yeah, so out. as doors and glyphs uh, okay. start appearing, opening and appearing. All right, I'm thinking I might do some more cleanse. What do you think? Or I could come over here and try to beat up. Uh, that's not where I have my, my but advantage, But there's stealth though. and humanoid, if that helps. You, uh, mm. you still have your two They're stealth good against advantages. Stealth. I am good against stealth. Should I head over there, and or are you going to go over there, Chris? Well, I was thinking about it until He's this came the quest. So maybe, I'll, quest would be maybe great. I'll head over and, and uh, try to, to punch a brigand in the in How many, the uh, how many warriors You're do you all have going west. I actually only have three warriors. Go that west, is a good young point. Man. That's a good point. I only have three warriors. I don't think that's a very good... And that's a level two. I, I only have might, two advantage. I probably need to reinforce. I think before. you might get a certain body part handed back to you. Okay. If you so <laughs> instead what I'm going to do is I'll move here and I will cleanse. Okay. Okay. And, and then I'll gain my two spirit. Okay. All right. 
All and right. then you're done. I believe I'm done, yes. So go ahead and drop your skull. Let's see if anything happens. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. Big, money, big money, big money, no whammies. All right, so brigands have spawned in five points in the mm. north. It's, uh, it's already one there. Oh, my goodness. It's already five one. Five points yeah. is... Uh, Oh, five pint. Oh, five five pint, pint. Yeah. Did I say five point? Yeah, five pint. Oh goodness. So wait, so so many baddies. How does that work? Do you have to fight each one? Separately? No, you just pick one to fight. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, and you can move through spaces with foes or okay. quests or whatever. That's right. fine. We also have frost trolls in the south and the middle sister. More right trolls. There. More trolls. That's it. All right. All right. Turn, Chris. Brutal warlord time. All right. Let's, Let's go. do something here. He's turned into a professional wrestler, which Correct. is fine. Oh, they, There's nothing yes. wrong with that. Oh yeah. yeah. Oh yeah! Brutal I mean, Warlord's gonna cleanse and go on quests and never fight anyone. Yeah, <laughs> that's my plan. I'll have the biggest batch of warriors you've ever seen. Brutal pacifist so completely warlord. Completely green. Completely green. All right, green. so you're completing the recruit Letha. Because I've got two wild advantages in the forest. Yep. In the okay. forest. So we're gonna hold to complete. Ooh. Oh, I don't get to do it. No, you don't get to do it, Chris. I don't get to. Sorry. Sorry. You don't get to do it. One day I'll sit at the big kid's table. That's right. a heroic sound, Roy. So that let's was see what Letha does. Here's triumphant, I would say. Her off real quick. Majestic. Now, if Letha had a weapon, what would it be known as? Uh, probably a lethal no. weapon. Lethal weapon. Yeah. <laughs> see what I did there, yeah, Chris? All that. right. Uh, if you end your turn in a forest, you gain six warriors. Six warriors. And it's Including a plus two right now, by the for way. beast advantage. Yeah. I don't think we have any beasts. Uh, oh no, I forget. Astrider's a beast. That's mm, right. He is a beast. So that's uh, awesome. That will help against the. Uh, yeah. yeah so uh, you didn't take your reinforce action yet, if I'm not I mistaken. have not yet. Oh, yeah. I've only moved two there. spaces. So I can move to the sanctuary. Or the village. Or the village. Or the village. But I would like to end my turn in a forest. Okay. To get that even more sense. warriors. That makes sense. We've got a lot of warriors Cannot that are going to waste that. here. But that's okay. They're just sitting around drinking coffee. Look, I treat my warriors nicely <laughs> before I send them to their doom. Okay. I'm going to yeah move my final space to the sanctuary. And then I will go ahead and let's see. I, we I already did, did the, your quest. I did the action, quest yeah. action. So you're going to reinforce. Yeah. So I'm going to reinforce. Uh, oh, and I did you get your two spirit? I did not get my two spirit. Now, mm -hmm. I was going to point out. Now you have five spirit. Oh, I do. So at the sanctuary, I can cleanse. Not, but that doesn't make not sense. Not cleanse. Not a cleanse. You can uh, remove all can of remove your corruption. Right. Right. That doesn't make sense. You can also level up. Unlock one of your. I, I for a second I thought you were at your citadel. But yeah, you're at no, I, I I would like to be. Yeah. Ironically, I could spend a spirit. Well, no, because you have to, to do that. To double at, the move. You have to do yeah. that before you start moving. And so you, you can't you, modify your move. You unlock oh, these gotcha. at your citadel. Yep. Okay. Yeah. It has to be but you your can do it next citadel turn. or yeah. any citadel. I'm excited okay. about that. I'm excited about not so fighting <laughs> more. Mm -hmm. So you can just gain a spirit if that's what you're. A will. And then you're going to gain those six Man, warriors I really need from to go to a village to get more people. Mm -hmm. All right. I have six. Pretty soon I'll be an unstoppable force, but not yet. We'll see. Gearing up. All right, so we have a door opening event. Okay. So I'm going to click this button, and one of these doors is going to glow. That bad boy right there. It's over here. Oh, no. Which one? Ah, so the corruption. Right Slide it off. Here's open. Ah. I didn't see anything bad right, happen. Nothing came out. That's good. <laughs> uh, but now that's a, an opening. All right. There's a red hole there. Uh, that's it for that, though. That's the only event. Terrifying. Your turn, Roy. So now, obviously, this hole means when you're dropping skulls in, more likely more they're going to start coming. They're going to come out. So to the, the ones east. that have gone in there have gone to they, some. They door. can get trapped, yeah, and behind one of these doors. It's like a yeah. giant, like a giant cube tower, skull tower. Yes, exactly. <laughs> Motorized evil. If you will. Cube tower. If you will. Yes. If the cubes are skulls. Let's just be clear. I won't. Okay. <laughs> All right, Roy. What are you going to do? Don't forget your potion. I do get a potion. My potion is. Whoosh, Another potion of dragon teeth. Now I can, now go you can ahead get and some, gain warriors, some warriors, dude. I let's, might, let's I might make try to take out this troll. Take out this troll. Um, man, I am a fan of that. Um, first things first, I am going to spend one to gain a treasure again. Okay. Um, when you defeat a stealth foe, gain a potion. This is against undead. That's against undead. That's against in lakes. Nothing's going to help me in mountains, though, right? Nope. No. Um, when you cross a river, you may move to any space adjacent to that river. That one's cool. Mm-hmm. And, this cool. One and we just need to burn through those treasures. Right. Otherwise, we'll never fight ask calls. Right, right. Potion. Potion and ask calls. When you defeat that a stealth foe, gain I three more. I'm going to actually take the amulet here, the lake one. Is Brian watching? We had this running joke that uh, I love the Amulet of the Marin, and like I always joke that it's the best treasure in the game. Oh. <laughs> uh, 
and then you make fun of me about it. I can go through the water. <laughs> I here. thought it was water. the amulet of Mario at first. No. I missed red. Actually, my it's favorite treasure in the game is. It's the okay. I'm going to feed the water to the Ifrit and right. get rid of it and to get water. So uh, no ask call treasure coming up. Unfortunately, it's a hallowed reliquary. We're mm. getting a lot of undead stuff. We are. Yeah. I'm going to spin the potion of dragon's teeth to go ahead and get. Does it matter? Can I do, do that in the, the yeah, middle you can of do combat? It during the combat. Yep. Yeah, you're drinking well, a I'm potion of combat. You know, one here, and then do so do the combat. What? Uh, how many advantages do you have? Not a whole lot. I have one currently, but I can spend yes, I advantages with treasure for that. Yep. Um, actually, is that a beast or no? It's not a beast. Nope. nope it's just humanoid. Melee. It's not magic. It's melee. It's melee. Yeah. Yep, so I really have the one, but I can spend treasures yeah. to get more. We want to fight? And I can do that in the middle of yep. combat as well. Okay. Yes, fight them. We're going to fight the Frost Trolls. These guys are jerks. Three cards, right? Yep. Whew. Just don't get that crit. Don't get that crit card, Roy. I already got the crit card last time. Um, place two skulls on two different yeah. buildings. Place a skull on two different place buildings. a skull on two different... When you cleanse, does it get rid of all the skulls? Yeah, I was going to yeah. say, that's not a bad one to just absorb, and you can put them on those anyway. Someone we know has a scepter. Now, the other thing to keep in mind, though, is the supply is getting a little bit low. Mm. Not, not crazy low yet. Not. Could I put them on the ones that are now Mike, and he can... You could, but remember, like you said, if you oh, when more you, than one there is right, if you spread them out, that's more cleanse actions you need to get rid of. But okay. you can put, you can do whatever you want. Let's, then, let's put them on these two, okay. then, and we'll just do that. So you're just going to confirm that card, so you saved your advantage. Yep. If you are on oh. an, or adjacent to a space with a skull, <laughs> lose sixteen warriors. Sixteen warriors, Chris. Sixteen. Woo! Unfortunately, you are on or adjacent to. <laughs> well, it already just had one, so I don't feel bad that I'm Start spending advantages. It's fine. That's what it's for. Spend my first advantage. It went down to eight, which I would not have even with spending one. So, which of those treasures are you getting rid of? That one. <laughs> I think I am going to get rid of a treasure. <laughs> you should. You should. Uh, That's what they're for. You can only man, hold I could four. I could have anyway. done this. That would have been what really smart to do. I could have spent it to remove to move a foe one space. I could have moved him so into. So keep in mind that when but you that spend, been, that would have been about the. That would have when you three. spend, you get rid of the treasure. Right, right, right. Yeah, I'm going to do this. I'm going to get rid of the lamp of darkness. So you'd rather have this gives you four adva or three advantages. Right. Yes. So. Yeah, it's better. So um, that goes so to the bottom. I, I still yeah. have. So you have three to three, three to spend now. now. Yep. So I'm going to do another one of these. Gain a gear. I'm going to gain a gear. Uh, what, what would you like? There's the magic stealth melee uh, advantage ones, or then there's trusted maps, increase your base move, leather armor, minus two warrior losses. So if I do card. melee, I could utilize that against him this combat? Yes, you can. So and I still have two advantages because yep. of the... Okay, I'm going to do the melee But you one. only have one card left, so I think you're only, only gonna... going to need two advantages to max it out, but that's yeah, fine. We'll see. We'll see. Okay, we'll see. so we confirm this. Yes. Woo! 16 warriors again. It's another one of that original card. Okay, so I'm going to use my first one. And we There's know no the, reason the step not to down max will be, yeah. Uh, so if you notice the circles on the bottom of the card, that's mm -hmm. like the card level. And you right, you know it'll be the same so every that time. So that one's maxed out. Gear? And then yep. I still have this. Can't do anything with the extra ones. Oh, because it's, it's maxed all the way out. Yeah, 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 all maxed. So, so, so you get I gain another gear. Another gear. Yep. What's, it, what's it to Whoa. be? Um, what does the blessing scepter, scepter do? It allows you to remove one skull from anywhere when you take a... When you, do when a you reinforce, reinforce, you can remove a skull from the building. That seems really good. I, I want a blessed scepter. Okay. Everyone loves the blessed scepter, look. Well, it's just going to help us do cl minimal cleanse actions wherever we're reinforcing, and I think that will defeat him. Any limits on gear that you can hold? Uh, yes, you can't have more than one of each type of gear. Okay. One of each you can't type. have duplicates. Okay, okay. confirm. Um, does right? that mean I need to spend one of my <laughs> potion of dragon teeth? No, no, put not, th that's potions gear, that's different. potions is fine. Because yeah. the only thing... So we're going to remove this guy, and we're going to take two spirit for the heroic was that, action. Was that upset... I Acceptable to you, Mike? Was that better, Mike? Did you take your right. two spirit? Right. He's not. Was that was I, I just need your approval? I'm trying to not be selfish here. I'm working on that. Uh, it was fine, right? So you can see the only thing more fashionable win. than a dusky cloak Can't win. is two dusky cloaks. Well, listen, true. you don't have a long sword, so this is true. But I do have a banner action, and so I'm going to use that banner action to move here. Yes, I'm going to use my banner action to move. Oh, whoa, do I need to put whoa, my skull whoa, in? Whoa, Hello! Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Hello! 
Oh my goodness. All right, you guys are going to like this one. I told you every once in a while it's going. This is new wares. You can take any of these treasures oh. and put them back and cycle the market. So. Any of them, right? Yeah, we you said, could put all three of them and cycle out. Well, we're trying numbers. to get ash, all the ash yeah, stuff. Yeah, and we don't really so. need undead, right? Right. So right. I, I so. think that looks like Go a full on. sweep to Let's me. Let's yeah. sweep them all. Let's sweep them all. Let's sweep all. Right. all in the Are we ready for this? This is going to be three Ascol in a row. I'm excited about There's it. There's one. And that's not an Ascol. It's a necklace Here's of two. haggling. Oh, necklace of haggling. And that's not an Ascol. Axe of But this one's going to be all three of them. No. Oakstone bow. I, I will say, like, these are two of the more popular treasures. Oh, okay. So that's good. It's so popular. All right. I Let's like the Axe of Soul oh, Rending. It's not oh, it. there's no beasts. Uh, so if there had been, this was Letha's event. Okay. If there had been beasts, she would have like tamed them, which would have leveled them down. Oh. So oh. she's not an ideal. It just so happens that we don't have beasts in this mm. uh, game. So she's her event's not going to be super helpful. But she's letting you know she's ready, willing, and able should a, okay. a beast well, appear. Thank you, Letha. Uh -oh. Thank you, Letha. Uh -oh. well, what is with the uh ohs? Well, well, now this we have a the time for uh -oh. We have a rotation event. I'm afraid. All right. And it's spinning. All right, we survived. We survived. <laughs> a rotation event. And you guys <laughs> probably can't see from this side, but now there was a hole here before. It and is now, now closed on my side. Oh, you have a glyph? There is a glyph. What is the glyph? An icon of it. It looks should like... match something on your hero board. It Ooh. looks like... Uh, it looks like reinforce. reinforce action. All right, so if you want to take the reinforce action, you have to spend the spirit while that glyph is facing you. That's fine. Because oh. <laughs> technically, I'm not in the east anyway. I'm technically in the it south. It doesn't matter where your hero is. It matters for the player. Mm. I'm going to move over there. <laughs> I'm champion of the north now. Right. Thank you for having All right. me. Back to me. So I'm going to I, use... I do want to start pointing out we all I, have I'm, okay. Yes, right now I'm going to get rid of one of them at least. Um, do I, gosh, do I, need to, do I need to cleanse then? Well, you also have your Blessed Scepter. I do. That's what I was going to do. I was so gonna, does Roy. So. I was going to come here and do my banner action uh, to move there. Then I was going to do a village action, which would allow me to then remove Reinforce, one of sure. those. So let's do that. Well, wait. So, oh, gotcha. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Um, what are you going to do for your heroic action? I'm going to go over there and battle. Oh, you're running all the way back over. Yeah, yeah, because I'm going to be getting okay. six right now. Okay. You can me, spend the spirit see. to make a 12, don't forget. To make oh that's yeah, a, that's, that's not the a bad idea. Oh, oh, oh. Min max your actions. It's all oh. about the min maxing. It is okay. So you now you could also roll the haggle die. <laughs> yeah, no. I have a feeling. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah the, the, I, I know. I know how, how you much. Roll. How much Justin wants us to roll the haggle die just makes us not want to haggle. Correct. So I'm going to move my four. So one, that's two. Uh, three, his starting four. Uh, um, virtue is that his move, base move is four. Actually. Correct. That's actually really good. Yeah, I don't hate it. Okay. So that spirit you spent to get the extra warriors, you didn't have to spend right. to double your move. Exactly right. right. And so now I'm going to battle. This wretched creature, which is a what am I fighting over there? Uh, brigand? They're brigands, okay. and they're in uh, they're in. Um, uh, Listen, if planes, you want to just keep so fighting the level one, maybe. yeah. So I I, I have and humanoid. Yeah, you have your two stealth, right? I have one stealth, oh, yeah. two Plus stealth. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. But but it's a humanoid, not a beast, right? right? So I have two two advantage. Okay. Here we go, brigands, two advantage. <laughs> that's right. Okay, here we go. The sound makes me feel very heroic, Roy. I know it's. I'm really liking the way that the app works all together with everything. Lose five Lose warriors. Five. I don't know that I hate that. Do you have? Well, I've got so all kinds of warriors. warriors. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I, yeah. I, I bad. Yeah. It looked like you had like I got three. lots of warriors. All right. Well, so th what that means, of course, is there's the uh, the next card you could max out and, like right. I said, gain something. That was kind of my thought. So I'll just because I don't think that's that bad. Okay. So let's confirm that. It's not bad for those five families, Mike. <laughs> Lose two, two warriors each for each skull. skull. That's all right. This is probably well, going to be a game. I'm going to get a gear probably one. No losses. Ooh, gain three warriors, Chris. Three, and then I'm going to turn these two in and make it a five. Yeah, you recruited from those families again. <laughs> That's correct. Confirm, and now right. they so are gone. So this goes off. You get two spirit for your heroic action. Mm. You guys are doing great. I'm not sure how to take that. I'm not either. With okay. A large grain of salt. And now I'm no, going to be putting one of these last yeah. three uh, skulls in... We need to cleanse, I think, at some point. Here. Yeah, 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 yeah. No event. Look at that. Beautiful. All right. Beautiful. Wow. And the month is still going strong. All right. All I, right. I have enough spirit that I could go. Um, I could. Uh, what is it called? Don't forget your banner action. Did you already do that? Oh yeah, yeah. Thank okay. you, thank you, thank you. I'm just sitting on a mountain of warriors. As they would say back in the day, it's raining, Matt. <laughs> 
Is that what they would say? Yes. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna yeah double move all the way over there. I could, I could maybe fight those guys, or I could cleanse something here. If you were gonna cleanse, I'd cleanse over here where there too. Spend a spirit One, to get two, over there. Three, four. I could, I could move six. Yeah, but it's so far away. You're the yeah. fighting guy. You have a million warriors. I know. You I do. know. It feels literally silly. a million warriors. I see. Also, at one, least oh, you have to be at a citadel to do that. Okay. Yeah. I want to get. Seven, I want to spend the spirit eight. on this probably to. It's like twenty-eight. Get an extra wild advantage if I double my move in a mm. turn. That mm. sounds real good. Mm -hmm. uh, so I'm gonna. That's wild. I'm gonna cleanse where I am. Okay. So that's gone. Right. Which I will soon be dropping. You'll right get two spirit. spirit. Make some change. Interesting. Mm. All right, I'm going to move two spaces up yonder to the citadel. I'm actually going to stand myself on top of the citadel, no. show them dominance, brutal, uh, and then I'm going to spend five spirit. To and we've unlocked our first virtues. So keep in mind also one of the other th aspects of the uh, main, main quest, quest is somebody has to have five virtues. Oh, wow. Oh, now okay. you have four. Like you, this counts oh. these. So you need one more. Okay. Uh, to Thank you very much, everybody. And then Thank you. Thank you. I don't know if you're moving anymore or. I have one uh, more movement. But if I stayed there. Are you in a forest? Right. That's if I true. stayed there, I, could, I, would, nope, I would be up to five again. So. That sounds good. Wait, oh, and I'm in a forest. Yeah, why are you getting... Oh, sorry, no, at the end of my next uh, heroic action. Yeah, yeah. Then I would have two more spirit, and maybe I could do that again. A quick question for you, Justin. Yeah. My banner action, does it work if I'm not in my kingdom? Yeah, and whatever kingdom you're in. <laughs> Here we go! Uh-oh. I don't uh, like the sound of that. No. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, this here. isn't good. This isn't good. This... This... Uh, are we dead already? Oh, he's, he's laughing. laughing. We're, We're dead. dead. We're We're all right, so this is, <laughs> you've lost the game. So here's here's the event. Let me show you what happened here. So we told you that there wait, was... Wait, wait. Two, place two skulls yes. in citadels in yes. your kingdom? How many skulls do we have left, Justin? We have so two. You have two. That's fine. Except that... Yeah. Oh, you just dropped. You're we right. did I just thought, drop. You, I okay. thought it was... Yeah, yeah, yeah. We need right. to cleanse. See, well, there are uh, no skulls. Cleanse, cleanse like, like the lost. wind, Roy. False alarm. You're okay. So hit continue. I think that is probably it. Oh, we also have an open door event. So let's well, go good. More ahead and see what out. doors open up here. Maybe there won't be a rotation. The skulls. Which one? Oh, here it is. It's over here. Ooh. Uh oh. Oh <laughs> snap! That so is. So you have the cleanse uh, <laughs> icon face glyph facing you. So, so you, you have to, to spend a spirit to cleanse. All right. All right. That's so fantastic. So. Oh, okay. We also have a foe strike event. Uh, that doesn't affect anyone though. It's only brigands. So the brigand strike. Each hero loses one item if a brigand is on or adjacent to their space, which is nobody. They're on the other side of the board. So that's good. Yeah. So this good. is called the gritty version. Gritty mode. Okay. Really, the only difference between gritty mode is the skull setup, mm -hmm. and uh, at least right now, this is part of what we're tweaking. But uh, also the uh, you get uh, basically one less turn per uh, month. Okay. So okay. Slightly okay. less time. How about next time we play on pretty mode? Pretty there pretty princess mode. There you go. <laughs> nice. All right, Roy. Don't forget All right. your. I do want <laughs> to gain a potion here. Is this cleanse every skull on the board? I'm gaining a potion of purifying oh, breath. It's that's good. It's minty delicious. That's great, Roy. Spend two to remove two skulls from any building. Not spend two. You're spending Just spend that two. to remove two skulls. Okay. Um, two. okay. Is there two skulls that are far away from me, though? There's, there's over there's by Chris, but he can, he can Well, but he now, also, though. right now, would have to spend spirit oh, to climb. Oh, he climb. would have to spend Yeah, maybe I should get rid of those and then go here and get rid of the ones beside me. That's so that a way great we're idea. You want to cover my slack? I appreciate it. I'm, it I'm busy right, at so we're using that? Yeah, that got, I'm going to use that to get rid of the ones over there. That's great, because that allowed us to, to get four skulls back into the... That's yeah. really good. Yeah. I mean, I'm not saying that uh, I'm MVP, but... I'm I don't know glad, what MVP I'm glad you're not, Roy, if I'm, if I'm being honest. Um, what all does the sanctuary let me do? You'd be able to flip over Gain your things. Or you can get Remove rid of your virtue. Remove all my corruption. Super, Roy, you, you, are you, are the most, corruption. you are the most violent player. Mm -hmm. So Ugh. I would call you MVP. Well, You're putting me to shame. They, they don't call me the brutal relic hunter for nothing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, I'm going to move to here. Mm-hmm. And for my heroic action, I'm going to cleanse and remove all skulls from my space. Mm -hmm. All right. I like it. Um, and then I do want to do a reinforce action, which is going to cost... Actually, I gained two. It's going to cost me two because I have this facing me, this glyph. Mm. Or it's going to cost me one, one because I have the facing the me, the glyph. Um, and then I'm going to spend five to get rid of my selfishness. Okay. So I have less corruption, and uh, I'm less likely to... Uh, 
kick the can. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm blanking. The lamp, lamp of hope doesn't do anything when you cleanse. Um, when you cleanse, remove. You can remove skulls from any space. Oh, okay. Ah. I could have gone somewhere. You else. You could have not moved there. Mm -hmm. But also, okay. when That's I reinforce, fine. which is what I just yeah, did, I can remove there. one skull from a building. Um, the building you reinforced. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. But that's fine. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, it's okay. I'll just do that. I could have gone to here and then done that. Yeah, but they would have only gotten rid of one there. So it, it, it's the same. It's fine. Yeah. All right. Uh, you have some movement left if you want to do that. Well, I mean, yeah. Because his I cleansing would have clean, could I could have gone here, one. and I could have cleansed right. here, and then gotten rid of that one. Yeah, it's, it's yeah. just the timing. I should. Yeah, I didn't read the because you, it's only where you reinforce. So you you wanted to reinforce in the sanctuary to get rid of the corruption. Yeah. Yeah. I could anyway, have. there are different ways you could have done it for sure. Yeah, How it much? I still. I used one movement. Yeah. I'm actually going to go. One two back to the bazaar. Okay. So that I can work on getting more treasures in the future. And I will drop a skull in the tower. Here we go. Uh oh, month ended. All right. Let's see what happens. Do we want to do this and sure in front of the thing there? So let's see. New quests. Right. Are we ready? In the Arsonists north. in the markets. Arsonists from the tower uh, are threatening the bazaars. If they succeed, the market will be impacted. Give protection. Requirement: um, quest in dayside and spend two gear. Or the treasure market will be permanently weakened. Oh boy! Oh wow! That seems bad for this current objective. It does seem bad. Ay ay ay! All right. Well, we what marked we it over there. there. Two gear. Two gear. I love my gear. I had gear. two gear, but I love my gear as well here. Right? All right. Yeah. What's the next one? Uh, we've got the smuggler's coin. Quest in three rivers and spend eighteen warriors to take the smuggler's coin quest item. This is in the east. It's uh, right here. Yeah. Oh. You don't have 18 warriors, right? So not yet. I have I have 12 right here. No, oh, okay. a whole nice. deck of uh, quest items mm -hmm. that can come up in various quests that can help for various things. So nice. they got the smuggler's, smuggler's coin. coin. Here's that. That's what you can get if you uh, complete that quest. Wow, that looks cool. After you reinforce at a bazaar, move any number of treasures from the market to the bottom of the treasure deck, then <gasps> refill. That's really good for this objective. It's amazing that that's synced mm -hmm. up like that. Isn't that wow, yeah, it's, it's, like it it's like it was designed. designed. Next time you make a game like this, huh. you should try to yeah. do that on purpose, Justin. It's the power of keep an Keep that over there. Or... There you go. Here we go. Well, we can put it beside this, because that's what it is. There you go. Yeah, yeah. All right. Oh, that's is that right. it, or we got anything else? That's it. All right. Uh, that's not necessary. All right. It's going full dress. So we're in month three. And uh, that was just you, so it's Mike's turn, right? I don't trust the tower, Chris. <laughs> I don't trust the tower either. All right. So I can move anywhere in my current kingdom, which is this kingdom. Oh, boy. Um, it's a lot of bad so stuff this one over there. Costs two gear. Bizarre which is all I've got, way. right? All I've got are my two gear. Yeah, we could always go to the bazaar first and get even more gear. Yeah, I mean, how important is it? Zone. I mean, because I could get there this turn and do that. I could get there this turn. Could you? Yeah, you I, only have, I am already I only there. Have, though. I only have one gear. Like, I could, that one costs eighteen warriors. This is the one that costs gear. So keep in mind with the dusky cloaks that adds. I'm sorry, I thought you had trusted maps. Never mind. Forget I said that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What do you think? How important is it is for us to get this? Um, I mean, you don't. It's important, Justin said. I, It'll yeah. be way easier for Chris to get it because he has like a ton of warriors over there. It's not going to hurt him nearly as bad as going to hurt us. If we do it, we're not going to be able to fight other things. Oh, because of the gear? Well, no, just because we're going to be spending. You have to have a ton of warriors to be able to do it. You don't have enough currently. No, no, I'm talking about the one to give up the gear. Yeah, that's over, that's here, over right? there. Mike. Right, I can get over there. Yeah. Do that. Okay, I, I think so use my so. banner to get me within four spaces of that. Yeah, just standing like okay. there is fine. Okay, it's you thing, yeah. okay that's great. Where, then, do you, where are you going to reinforce? I'm about to say, when you want to go oh. to the bazaar and get more gear first. Yeah, is, you can go to the. You can go ah. teleport here and still get there in four. So okay, well, let's fine. do that then. This is a bazaar. Oh, right, that by is the way. on the bazaar too. Oh, that's a good. So if you teleport, yeah, it so doesn't you, matter. It's yeah. that's your banner. Okay, so just move me there. Well, because I'm going to be able to remove that skull because of my scepter. Well, yeah. now, now, what's the timing of this? Because I'm going to be giving this up. But that's for well, the quest action. I would do, okay. I would do the reinforce, reinforce first, first right. and then yeah, reinforce. Right, right, right. Okay, so reinforce. Uh, what I will do is... What I'm at a, facing you? Oh, you paid for your spirit. Yeah, I'm I at, a, I'm at a bazaar, right? So do I want to gain a treasure or do I want to gain a gear? So something to keep in mind, obviously, mm -hmm. you're working towards 
the objective is going to drive Astrider out of the tower. Okay, and he once is. they come out, then you got to fight them. Right, they're a magic beast. So okay. those are also advantages you might want to keep. All an right, eye out so for. let me let me go ahead and get a. Let me get a magic advantage. All right, that's the brass towel. And you can remove that. Can you move that uh, for me there, Chris? Because God. I've got that. Um, all right, so I will do that. And now I will do my quest action. Okay, and I will give up my stealth and my blessed scepter. Oof. I hate that, but all right. So this is the smuggler's coin quest, correct? I hit that. No, no, no. no. Oh, it's the, it's the that uh, one over there. Oh, yeah. yes, this Markets. one. Okay. The so Ash, when Ash you Strider. lose gear, it just goes right back on top of the stack. You can always cool. get them again. Later. Okay, so I press okay. this, correct? Yeah, just press it once, and, and they're all the same complete. gear in each game, or yep. is it no, the quest gears, dependent? Gear, gear markets all the same. Okay, the quest gotcha. gear is quest items. Too. It's a good sound, Mike. That's a bad sound, Mike. No, that was him being mad that you completed the quest and foiled him. Okay, it doesn't the give me anything. The effect is that, that you prevented the market from being. Okay. Good. So that's why I'm talking about a little wonky with some of the text. Got it. It sounded very the effect uh, was triumphant. You prevented to me. something bad from happening. Correct. Now, do, uh, I still get my two. Two spirit for questing, yeah. Okay, that's fantastic. Fantastic. Okay, so I've got a magic and a beast advantage, which is good against Ash Strider when he comes out. Yep. Right. We, oh, uh, now I get the smuggler's coin. No, too. no, no. Oh. That's here. <laughs> I want the smuggler's coin. He <laughs> noticed. All right. So I set it over here. You have uh, one space you know. of movement left because oh. your move is four, uh, and you only moved three. The only reason I mention that is you are right next to two brigands. brigands. Yeah, yeah. I probably need to get out of so there. I don't know that the event will go off, but if it does, it could affect. You. Can you move me into the um, the land of confusion? Is there a desert near me? Because yeah, I have the tundra. There. Let's do that. There you go. Okay. All right, uh, skull time. Mm. Skull, skull time. time. Just like the old, good old days. Hamana, 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 hamana. All right, Letha, that's Letha. She okay. would have uh, tamed the beast, but again, we don't have beasts in this game. Letha. Tame the humanoids. We do have a rotation event. Oh boy, that could be interesting. This, yeah, listen, it could be more skulls, you know, that you guys do. And I have two skulls that popped out on my All side. All right, so you, now you have to put those on buildings in your... So because they fell on this side, they go in this in side, the, in even kingdom. if they roll into another area? Correct. It doesn't okay. matter where they land. It matters where they come out. <laughs> okay. And the person who runs you can, that kingdom you can decides here, where they put them. But you're not going to do that, right? Yeah, but I, I think I will cleanse, but I'm probably also going to not put it where I'm currently standing because I could cleanse somewhere else. Could you put them both in the same spot? You can put them anywhere you want in your kingdom. What is what is the threshold of when they get broken? Yes, I can't believe I didn't mention that. Uh, each building can hold three skulls. Mm. Three skulls. If ever a fourth skull would go on a building, it's destroyed. The mm -hmm. skulls that are already in there get removed from the game, so oh. that obviously diminishes the okay, pool. I'm gonna put, skull pool. I'm gonna put two there. I've got a plan. Don't okay. don't mess it up. We it haven't seen any turn. rumors yet this month, so I'm sure it'll be fine. Have you ever been to the skull pool, Chris? I wouldn't recommend it. <laughs> but. The skull pool is not for amateurs. <laughs> All right. You're up, Chris. Oh, Did you get your, uh, forget your spirit banner action? for your heroic action? Better. I didn't do anything. Oh, he hasn't gone yet, has he? No, no it's, it's Chris's turn. Oh, it's Chris's turn. So I've got to go one, two, three, four, five, <laughs> six spaces. So I'll have to spend one spirit. All right. And that gets you over there? Yes, sir. Okay. It gets me I'll also maybe. point out, you guys are on the same space. You can trade at any time. Yeah. Hey, I, I can, I can now trade. I'm yeah. no longer selfish. You've repented of your, your terrible ways. Why don't you give him some more? Why don't you give him some of your warrior cards? He needs some. I was say if we that. could go the other direction, but that's fine. Well, you all mocked me, but now I'm spending 18 warriors to complete mm. the ally quest. Hey, you know who doesn't get the smuggler's corn? Not Mike, Chris. Yeah, smuggler's corn. That's smuggler's a very look, different. smuggler's <laughs> corn. It's delicious. <laughs> if you've ever had it, oh my goodness. All right, so hit the uh, that one, yeah, and then uh, hold to complete. Wait, we're letting hold Chris to touch complete. the iPad? Yeah, that was, I figured, that, was that was a mistake. It's not really. A, After he a does something good, he can touch it. With a rackish wink, the leader of the Thieves' Guild flips a coin at you. Use it well! I will. I'm going to let him do all the mm. events there. That was good. All right. So now you get the Smuggler's Coin. Uh, important ability. Don't forget to use that. By quest, did I get two spirits? Yep. And does right. this get removed? Yes. I am at Questing it up. a bazaar. You are indeed. So... Uh, okay, after you reinforce at a bazaar, move any number of treasures from the market to the bottom of the deck. So I have to purchase a treasure Or it first. could be a gear. You can or just do the basic gear. reinforce action, and then you can cycle right. all three of those if you want to. Uh, are there any advantageous there, treasures? There's no... Uh, so, uh, actually, well... Not really. Not particularly. Not for the Honestly, uh, the faster we can get the Ash yeah. stuff, the Keep better. Keep stealth, Because we're already in... 
Yeah. We're already in the right. third so month, you, right? So you could always take a gear and then I'm just gonna, cycle all three of these. That's what I'll do is okay. I'll take a gear. Uh, and I'm going to take, I'm going to jump in on that Blessed Scepter Club. Get in on it. Right, I'm a fan of Blessed here. Scepter. Cloak of Stars, Spear of Atish. <gasps> Oh, that's not. Man, no. you guys, uh, it's good thing you got that smuggler's coin because your regular Ascol mining is not happening. Well, that is rough. Ascol doesn't go by the surname Astiche occasionally? No. Yeah. Right, I'm fine. afraid not. I'm trying. I'm trying, <laughs> fellas. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, there scold you go. me, baby. All right. That sounds great. Rumor. <laughs> fires gather in the tower. Spies say the fires will rain down on a sanctuary. Okay. Who's in a sanctuary? Anybody? Nobody currently. All right. Oof. Oh, we have some new uh, spawns. Also, the frost trolls have spawned in the iron tops. Mm. Iron tops. That's it. That's okay. okay. Back to me. Okay. Um. So now I have a glyph showing my banner action. So I would have to spend one of these to, gain to a potion. take my banner action to gain a potion. You can Ooh. choose not to do that. But it does seem kind of worth it. How much does it normally take to get a potion? That's free. Sanctuary. At the at the Citadel? Uh, Citadel, sorry. Yes. Yeah. Um, I, I'm i going to do it because I'm these potions seem pretty good. So I'm going to gain a potion. Okay. Um, so I'm gaining potion of 1,000 strides. I can spend it to move any hero up to three spaces. Mm. That could be very useful at the right time. I like that you drink this potion and you're like, Mike, go over there! <laughs> yep. <laughs> um, I am going to be using my uh, Lamp of Hope. So when I cleanse, I can remove skulls from any space. That's so I'm right. going to remove move them from the sanctuary there. Okay. Sanctuary! So I'm getting rid of three, and I gain two here. Yep. Um, and then I will do a reinforce action, which I no longer have to pay for because I don't have the thing there. Um, I'm going to do it in the bazaar. I'm going to spend... Um, one spirit to gain a treasure because I have prepared. I can gain a treasure with just one instead of two. Um, the question is what I want. When you defeat a And, and that smuggler's coin only works for Chris, correct? Ten. When he's at a right, yeah. correct. beast advantage. This so the really Ash Rider's a beast, uh, and dragons are beasts. We don't have a dragon right. yet. But and this guy's melee, so if I killed him, I'd end up getting ten warriors, which would be really, Really quick question. Yeah. Uh, you're allowed to share items. Yeah, so you. With oh, hold, so hold on, space. you're right. That's a good point. I forgot in the same space. He could mm. trade it to him right. and then take advantage of that. That is true. You're not selfish anymore. So here you go, sir. Okay, cool. He could have taken. So I could do and this. Selfish. And when do I do the now. shuffling out? I do that first. So it's after you after take you. the. Mm -hmm. Oh, after I take the reinforcement. So you can take one of these treasures, and then or you could take a gear and then cycle any of the treasures you want. I actually really like this spear. So take it. You're the relic okay. hunter. Yeah. And then, the these then we replace. Oh, okay. Oh. Uh, so there's three different scrolls in there, one for each of the main types of advantages. Um, so can I could cycle them all? Cycle, cycle them all three. To Hunt try for to those get to assholes. the things. Yeah. So we sure. want those. So these go on the bottom. Yep. Come on. And then three more. Big money. There we go. No, two, two, of two of them. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and because I took a reinforced action and I have the Blessed Scepter, yeah. I can then remove a skull from the building space I'm there in. So Look I'm the one that needs to get these, right? Because it needs to be with one person. Or we could trade well, But them. you can trade them. Yeah, yeah, we so could trade. Ultimately, it will need to still, be one person. I still keep in mind, moved. that person has to have five virtues. So oh, it has to, you might want to get them to Chris. Yeah. Oh, it has to be the same you have, person. Oh, with so you have to take the quest action in that space, have four treasures and five virtues. Got it. And then I can still move for my turn. You can do that in yep, any order. Yep, so yep, yep. I'm going to now. Can he trade now? Like maybe give that coin back to me? No. You know, one trade per turn. Okay. Yeah. Um. Well, I traded on. Oh, okay. It was on his. It had I oh, traded on No, my was turn. it on your turn? I could have. I oh, forgot let's say that you did then. Yeah. I mean, mm -hmm. you can trade it back. I'm not sure that that helps though. But if if it makes sense. Well, he's he might bizarre before he leaves there. Oh, that's yeah. a good. But point. we don't really sure. want to clear. We can maybe clear those out. This one. Yeah. That's true. That's true. We're yeah. just spending the same coin at the at the bazaar. They have no idea. <laughs> it's like on a string. Here you, you go. You don't spend it. You just flash it. Yeah, that's so right. Like, you know. <laughs> I think I'm going to move. How many skulls we have there? <sighs> All right. Okay. Okay. I'm going to move over to the village here. Okay. And then I am good. And then we're going to drop in. Uh-oh. Brigands just leveled up. Okay. So the Brigands have leveled up. What that means now is they're, uh, I forget, it's, it's a Savage, I think, is above ready. Okay. And uh, so basically, 
remember how you leveled those cards? Now they're starting one higher. Oh wow! So, okay. it's, you, can, so you, you still need only more draw. Advantages. You still only draw two cards, okay. but you would need an extra yeah. advantage to get them to where they are. And also, Gross. their events will hit harder. So, for example, I'll just tell uh, you. No, okay. I'm not going to tell you. Let's All find right. out. We'll find out when it happens. <laughs> I love right. that. That sounds very encouraging. I love that. So now they're going to run further to smash you in the face. They are. Okay. So I've got a banner. Actually, I'm, I'm kind of trying to figure out what we what we need to do at this point. Um, I'm really enjoying some of the combos you can set up by getting all of the different cards out and being like, okay, I'm gonna use this ability and then use this thing and this thing. It's that's When you trade, can you trade any number of things? Yep, and they don't need to be even. You can trade one way, as long as it's just one all trade right. per I turn. Think, and I think, uh, and you can only buy one thing from a correct bazaar per right. turn, correct? Yep. All right, um, let's... Chris, for my banner, can you just throw me into that bazaar there in Bayside? Or Dayside, perhaps? Dayside, yeah. Bayside High. Uh, you're Bayside, I think, Screech. was in Saved by the Bell. Yeah, yeah you're going to hang out with Screech and Slater. <laughs> Bayside is uh, right over here. Yeah, there is. There is. All right, uh, so what I'm going to do for my reinforce is I am going to spend two and gain a treasure. Mm. Let's get... This can prevent us in a dungeon. Spence Beauty. Oh, now that's interesting. Ooh. I like that. The Golden Mace of Azkal. Went on a space with a foe. Spend Spirit equal to that foe's level to remove it. So you, wow. it, you do without battling. Wow. It doesn't count as a heroic action. Right. So you don't get the two spirit. You don't get any, like, no benefit. But you yeah. also just remove them. So okay. that can be quite potent. I like it a lot. <laughs> okay. That's awesome. So that was my reinforce. Now I can still move and take a heroic action. Um... Oi, wait, 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 wait. So quests are not happening, right? The quests um, are done. Okay. Uh, you have Frost Trolls and you have the Brigands. Is there is there a Brigands? Wow, but they've leveled yeah, up. Yeah, they've leveled up, and I don't think you have, like, any advantages against I, them. Am I, I wrong? I, I, don't, I don't think so. What, what are the um, Frost Trolls? What are their... He, Frost Trolls stealth. are he has, melee. He has one advantage. I have one oh, stealth. Oh, that's right. Yep, okay. None of them are in forests nope. or, or in um, deserts, right? Nope. No. Oh, they're in the water. So I have magic beast and undead. What are we? What, what are the? I'm the sorry, frost the trolls are melee and humanoid. The uh, brigands are brigands stealth, stealth and, and uh, humanoid. So basically, you don't have advantage against anything that's in the game unless I they're standing one. on a desert. No, I've got one stealth. Oh, I know. Yeah. I mean, do I cleanse? If you're not going to fight, then and I probably you I probably quest, do, then right? you should cleanse. Yes. What right. is what is this quest here? What is it? That's need the to main. Be? That's, that's the that's, main objective. Yeah. The main so we have to have everything to get yep. there. Five virtues, four of Ascal's treasures. Same person. Yep. Wow. Ooh, you right. can trade as many things yep. in one you, trade. You can't actually. trade virtues. But yes. Okay. Um, can you move me to the plains, plains of, of Lobo? Yeah. So, All right. uh, how much movement do you four. have? Four. One, two, three. And then let's cleanse there. Right. I'll take my two spirits. Nice. And now that's it, right? Yep. Nice. Mm -hmm. New wares. Oh, first oh. we didn't. Oh put yeah, this we one did out. not. Oh, there's ah. a yes. Is that all? So this could be you have right. four, four, so you could cycle. This is new wares, so you okay. can cycle if you want to. <laughs> you have ask all this stuff. I'm saying if you, for example, you didn't like Camarius Carp. Oh, we, we can cycle this ditch. one? Yeah, sure. Let's do it. Any any number. But you don't need more ask all stuff at this point. You just should find it's treasures. It's all ask all stuff. At this point, oh, look, you got the banner, mm -hmm. too. You, when it rains, it pours. So importantly, what you want to do is you guys have the treasures, obviously, available at least. Mm -hmm. uh, one more virtue here, for example, right. just to right. get them out. You want to start thinking about gearing up to actually fight okay. the, right. the boss. So, mm -hmm. uh, again, uh, magic and beast advantages. Does that All mean... Right. But also things like leather armor might help mm -hmm. or so things that might... So one person has to summon him and then is anyone everybody going to be able a to battle him? Anyone can battle him, yeah. Okay. All right. And you, it might take a couple of battles to defeat him. I'll explain how that works when we get okay. to the adversary. Okay, okay. sounds great. Let's see. Uh, oh, man. Well, like I said, when it rains and pours, whoever has Zeta gets the top part of the treasure deck. Ooh. Ooh that's a good one. Circle of Conviction. Nice. And on the other hand, we do have that's another good door humanoids. opening. So whose door is opening here? Is it on the front? Roy, is it your door? Oh, it's right. Oh, it's right here. Okay. So it just slides yeah, up. Yeah, it just slides up. It might be a little stiff. That's one of the things we tweaked after the Oh, that one's not too bad. Okay, okay so it's showing a glyph. So but nobody's no sitting there, there, so that's fine. Yeah, that's right. And we do have a rotation event. So that glyph goes to Z. So this saucy in a second here. It's going to cost you extra Z. 
Oh! 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 <laughs> Another one over here, too. So where did they come out? I wasn't watching. Yeah, I came out north, I believe. Everything all out north, was all right? north. Okay, so all of those need to go on buildings in the north. Wow. That's all you. This came uh, out actually, this side. Actually, hold on one oh, second. No, they all, oh, no, no, no they... this one came out this side. Oh, okay. All right. Ah! Yeah, we had a jam event, unfortunately. Uh... And we're still partially jammed, it, uh, partially offset. It'll fix though. It's okay. fine. Uh, this is the stuff we're tweaking with that. So that actually came out of here. Yeah. Yeah, it came out of my west. Oh my gosh, region. that's a lot of skulls. All right. So when it rains, it pours. Mm -hmm. uh, that works for treasures and skulls. So. But we have wow. opportunities to cleanse we do. We do. If we hey, get over there. Hey Mike, there's a skull here already. Should, mm -hmm. I, should I put them? I mean, I can move or? there and cleanse if, if that's what we want to do. But there's so many over here already. I'm not worried about the village getting destroyed. I know that sounds really selfish. It sounds almost brutal of mm -hmm, me. Mm -hmm. I'm less worried about it getting destroyed. Or we could just put it in any other building. Let's see. All right. So let's that should reset this. the next time we drop a skull. But if it doesn't, I can okay. go through the thing. Okay. All right. Um, that's why we have firmware updates. <laughs> <laughs> Whose turn was that? That was your turn, right, that Mike? That was All Mike, right. yeah. Chris, take your word. Whew. All right. We got a pile of warriors You here. should be beating people up. Uh, I know. It's hard. Well, I... But we also need to buy some we more of these items. We do need to buy stuff. We need to get ready to gear. Yeah, and... Uh, also, it would be nice to be trading, you know, getting getting you... Getting we, stuff towards mm -hmm. me. Yeah, I've, I've got four spirit. I need five mm -hmm. to get my last virtue. Correct. Uh, mm -hmm. So... Next heroic action you take will do that, of right. course. Oh, and the glyph is no longer facing me. The problem was I couldn't cleanse. Yeah. Because it would cost me. Right. So, let's see. We're, you were right here in the uh, right there. three rivers. So, I'm two spaces away from so, that yeah. thing. I could, uh, all right. So, if you move me over to... Well, uh, just do, I just want to make sure you keep in mind, once you start moving, you can't modify your movement. So if you want to double your move now, you need to do that. But oh, that's right. Okay. So let me think about it. If I move, if I cleanse... Uh, you have exactly oh, enough, right? Where's the citadel? It's all the way over here. You can move there. Okay. One, two, three, four. You know, so I will do as maybe was mm -hmm. Suggested, out. yes. Suggested, suggested yes. So, yeah, so I'm going to move too. first to the Duane, uh, where it's got the two Duane, skulls. Yeah. Duane. Mm -hmm. Duwani the Rock Johnson. I'm going to mm. cleanse. <laughs> All right, go ahead and take your two spirit for that. All right, two spirit. Although you really don't deserve it after that joke. And I'm going to move the rest of the way over to the Citadel and... Citadel! <laughs> and also you <laughs> have the Blessed Scepter, right? Yes. Oh, snap. So this yeah. goes away, too. Get that skull out of there. All right, nice. I'll make sure you get your combos, Chris. I'll make sure I get <laughs> I'm going to wash that Which skull virtue are you taking? out of my head. Min Callus. Max. Min After Max. a battle, if you lost at least 10 warriors, gain a treasure from the market. Oh. I'm ready for some fighting. About time. Has he fought anything yet? I have not fought a single thing. <laughs> <laughs> Read this card. This card's crazy. Uh, so how we're going to just, just drop it? Drop it. Spin instead of oh, oh, a skull from right. the tower this turn. Oh, um, take another turn. All right. So we have uh, awesome. radiant trolls and uh, so instead frost of trolls. Your turn, and, just take yeah, another put that turn. on a mm -hmm. building. Mm -hmm. uh, seems this legitimately awesome. It seems good. And this goes on the uh, radiant mountains right there. Right there. Yep. Oh, and we have our first dragon. Dragon. In the bone hills. Hey, oh my! Look, it's right next to right next to the relic bone hills. Nice. All right. Try um, I don't know if I should be fighting it. Or probably not. You've got one. Well, no, I can get. I'm in the village. I can get 12. Oh, okay. And I have 12 more right there. That's true. Is the dragon a magical beast? Uh oh. Uh, dragon is melee beast. Melee beast? All right, I'm going to try something. I'm good oh, at melee. I like the way that sounds. I'm good well, at melee. So the problem is, so it's, it's half. Uh, oh, I got you. Okay. There, if I could, if I reboot it, it's going to spin, which means skulls are going to drop. So that's why I'm trying not to do that. So let's just leave it as for it. right now. It okay. is like it's once just we, only a sliver open. Once we get the first rotation event, it'll correct. What it is is it's very interesting. If you want to know the technical, so this is a sure good example of what's going on behind the engineering of all this. So there's actually an IR sensor up there. Mm -hmm. And then it, there's, a, there's on the top of this drum, there's reflective paint uh, that basically the sensors read, and that's how it knows what the rotations are. Something like this. I don't know. I don't understand all of it. <laughs> Importantly, 
uh, they just sort of printed the paint on, and what they're noticing is that the reflective reflectivity is not quite high enough. So now they're going to, when they do the actual towers, this is why we do the mm -hmm. final engineering towers. They're going to actually like spray paint it on so that it's heavier coating, and that seems to be solving. The, apparently, they've already done that. Seems to fix the problem, but nice. That's the kind of stuff that my engineers right. are dealing with that I don't know anything about. That's <laughs> Avenger! <laughs> yeah. Nice. Adventure some spray paint. Mm. <laughs> so my turn? Yeah. Yeah. Sh is there any point for me to fight the dragon, or should I just run away from it and go do other stuff? Is the dragon going to do terrible things to us if we don't deal with it? Uh, well, foes have events. Mm -hmm. They do have events. Mm. I don't want it. I don't like it. Um, I think the first thing we're going to do here... You've got so much stuff over there. I do have lots of stuff, and I want to spend my stuff. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to do a reinforce axe action here in the village, and I'm going to gain 12 warriors. And you do that, you spend a spirit because you have a glyph facing you? No, because I want to get 12 instead of just oh, instead one. of the yeah, six. Yeah, yeah, great. Yeah, my bad. Yeah. Sure. Um, and, you, then, and you don't want to roll the haggle die, though. No. <laughs> okay. But also... Let's see what would haggle. have happened. Oh, it's a good thing you didn't do it. Uh-huh. Oh. See? Now I got the I got the bizarre got closed out, out of it, right, so now sure. the next one should be good. Uh -huh. yes. Anyway, when I do the reinforce action, um, I can remove a skull yep. from where I'm at. All right, look at that. You guys are keeping mm. your skulls in check. Yeah. You know, got to do the thing. Um, and then, where do I want to go? I need things to actually do. I might go up there and fight that dude frost up there. Trolls. The frost troll is a little bit easier to handle. Um, so yeah, I'm going to move one, two, three against the Frost Troll. All right, are you ready? Have you calculated your advantages yet? Um, he's humanoid, right? No, melee humanoid, yes. So I have one, two, three. Three. Um, I have three. And then I can discard to gain like a ton more. Uh, and you can is discard that those that's once per? Once per turn. Right. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So three. Right. Ready yeah. to fight? Yes. Okay, Frost Trolls. He's only ready, so he's not as. Bad yeah, he's as not savage. savage. Okay, fighting him. Ash Strider is lethal, apparently. Yeah, they start so out. There's three here. Okay, first one. Seven warriors seven and two warriors spirit. Seven warriors and two spirit. You don't have the spirit. Nope. And I do have one, two, three advantages. Ugh. I'm going to do one of my advantages on this. I don't have any spirit. In for a penny, in for a pound, mm -hmm. right? I'm going hard. <laughs> lose three warriors. All right. Done with that. I didn't want to lose my spirit. Going I'm, this sure you won't spirit yeah, I'm sure these next two cards probably is good. Yeah. Yeah. It's, fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. No corruption at all here. What is that one? Uh, if you're on or adjacent, which you are not. not the space right. of skulls, yep. lose 16 so warriors. that has no effect. No so effect. So you can and ignore that one. Woo -hoo. Outstanding. Lose one gear or five warriors. That's not bad. And you have one advantage left. Yeah, I was going to say, you might, yeah. there's no reason not to spend your advantages, so keep that in mind. Or two warriors. Um, and these are gear? Yep. Uh, or potions or not. Just the, oh, yeah, the items. Gear. Yeah, I guess I'll just lose the warriors. Yeah. So it's Glad just you loaded two up warriors. On 12. So there we go. Well, I have 12 more right here, technically, in potions. Yeah, right. no, I'm, I'm All right. That sounded sarcastic. Oh, I'm glad you defeated that troll. Good I job, Roy. I troll. like that the Dark Tower is very annoyed with AP. It, it, yeah. it, it, it's like. <laughs> <laughs> it's not it's AP. True. I was actively doing things. All right, so then. that's removed, and you got your spirit for taking your heroic no, battle action. No, you did not. Right? And then I get my two spirit. Yep. And then instead of uh, spending a skull. I think I'm going to do this. Oh, boy, he's taking another Using turn. Using the circuit of conviction, all right? So Ooh. this one you spend instead of dropping a skull and take another turn immediately. So this goes to the bottom. Rick, shot. What are you going to do with this extra turn, though? Right. Did you um, even think? You, you were so busy <laughs> no, no, no. wondering if you could. You didn't. Did you even think, Roy? You should. <laughs> Is there any with three on it? And I yes, can, there's I, one with, right here. With the there's lamp one with of hope, right here. With the lamp of hope, I can cleanse skulls from any space. Okay. Right? You can actually make there in three. You don't get bonus points for getting rid of extra skulls. I'll just point that out. But that's fine. You can do that. I'm there's also just, this whole north region here, which is... Uh, over there, I where the, the, is right. that the troll? <laughs> this one, yeah, this one's a frost troll. Yeah. <sighs> where do I need to go? I'm still going to do that, though, for my main thing. I'll reinforce to get one of these items that I can hopefully trade in the future. Did you do your uh, banner? I haven't card. done my yeah, banner. You take another action. That's right. I get 
spin to gain plus one wild advantage. That mm, seems awesome. That's nice. Oh, that's, oh, nice. that's great. Um, then I will cleanse where there's three over there for my action. I will gain two of these for taking that, and then I will move. Should I move towards like you? Well, the thing is, I'm thinking of moving towards Chris so I can start giving him. Should I move towards, wait, Chris isn't sitting on the right thing. Yeah, I'm over there at the moment. I'll probably end up going to this bazaar to try and. Well, I'm just thinking about trying to get closer together so that way we're yeah. in the same area. Is there a skull where you're at? No, there's not a skull there. There's a bazaar all the way over here, right? That's where those are? Yeah. That's way too far. Um, How many spaces? I could move six. You I can't get one, there in two. six, right? Yeah, you can. Yeah. Because you're in the inside of the circle, so that's one, Whoa, two, that's nice. three, four, five. I'll, I'll spend a spirit to get there. All right. And that, this is legal, right? Yep, 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 yep. Two, three, four, five. Yep. And then I will spend... One to gain one of these. Does it matter specifically? I mean, they do different right things. Um, beast advantage. Uh, Ash Rider is a beast. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm going to be mostly giving it to someone else, I think. Although, yeah, the main effect also is like After dungeon. you reinforce, you may also gain. After you reinforce at a sanctuary. Uh, that's not good for me right now. Well, I'm just going to take this. All right. If you take a banner action of any hero instead of your own. Ah, that's really cool. Okay, um, Ooh, that is cool. And then I'm going to uh, do, since I did the action, the reinforce action, the take Blessed off one of the, Scepter one of those skulls So it takes off one of those skulls. Oh, yeah. I like this 18 minute turn rule of taking. <laughs> Sorry, I, I haven't <laughs> stopped doing things though. It sounds like sarcasm, he, he but I a like lot of it. Concession. Yeah. Yes. Um, I did all of those things. I did that. Yep. I did that. When you do a trade action, if there are multiple people in the same space, can you all trade within each other? Yes. Or, okay, cool. While I'm sitting here, you guys come to me. All right. We're um, coming to And then I will actually drop a skull in here. Yeah, why not? We can get all these items to Chris if we all okay. go together. Right. You're going to put that one on. We also have a rotation event, so hopefully this will fix the uh, yeah. drum. Oh, not quite. Oh, gross. Whoa. All right, so oh, yeah, now it's. No, we don't so. want this to be destroyed accidentally. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and put them. There we go. Oh, that yeah. fixed it. All right. All right. Self repair nanites. All right. Fantastic. That oh. tower is ah, so. Brigands cool. have spawned in the south in the Bone Hills. It's a oh, big that's, monster that's party a nasty in the Bone Hills. Monster yeah. party. The, the Bone Hills mm -hmm. have really gone downhill. They yeah. have. <laughs> all right. All right. So you got, Mike? you're saying that we want to all kind of meet where you are, Roy. I'm just saying, if you come over here, and whether you buy a thing or not, or whether Chris goes and buys a thing, if you buy a thing, then there's four things, and Chris could have all of them. And He's you, already got you've his already five got virtues. Your five. You've already got your five, and you need how many treasures? Uh, four treasures. treasures. Five, four of. So we need to. Can, that, that will take four turns, though, right? No, no you can no, trade, no, you like, trade them all. Oh, yeah, if we're them all them in the same space, we, we do it all at the same give time. Give it to them, yeah. So that's what I'm saying. We, All right. You come so over here, buy are. one, and... Yeah, am I within four of where Roy is? You are. Let's make one, that You come happen. over here, Two, cleanse three, that space, buy four. one, whatever, All right. you know. So, uh, I went there. I moved. I'm going to um, cleanse, or do I want to... Yeah, I'm going to cleanse. Let's cleanse. So you're just removing the skulls? From removing me? the skulls. Cleanse them. Right. All right, and then I can reinforce. What kind of a building am I in? Bizarre. That's bizarre. All right. Um, Two for a treasure. Yeah, let's get a treasure. Let's get Ascal's... That carpet looks pretty good. Yeah, no, I think <laughs> I'm going to go with the, this one right here. Scrolling. So I've got If three. there was any question on whether or not Justin is trying to hinder our progress... I have not. He's trying to hinder our progress. Just Scroll of the burning sands. Okay. You're like uh, that mean dungeon master. I believe that that is my turn, right, I do want to point... No, I don't know why I'm helping you all, but fine. <laughs> I just want to point out the scrolls. What they are? They're all. They all work the same. Spend to get a bunch of it for the yeah. advantages. Magic is Ash Rider's magic. Oh, yeah, and that's really four advantages. I mean, that's not a bad scroll. Anyway, well, all right. Wait, you don't have a thing that lets you take an extra turn? That's so crazy. <laughs> am I, so you haggle, you, you <laughs> reinforce again without haggling? Am I am I correct that no one has used the haggle die? Listen, You're you get you notice there was a lot of risk. I and feel not like a this was a waste putting it Justin, in the game. Here's if what's happening. You know what's happening with this haggle die? It's, it's going, going in the tower. tower. <laughs> 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 hey, why are you corrupting my area over here? All right. 
Let's play some Poseidon. That's, That's interesting. Cool. Okay, so the tower, uh, remember the rumor about the sanctuary? Yeah, yeah I remember. So uh, the tower shoots fire into the land, place two skulls on the sanctuary in your current kingdom. You will notice that the sanctuary already has two skulls. Oh, so that building's so destroyed. So one of those is going to come back, and then that building's going to get destroyed, and oh. those three of those skulls are going to get removed from the game. Not a huge deal. You guys are doing yeah. pretty well in skulls. Uh, importantly, that's a dormant kingdom, so not a huge deal. If somebody were playing that kingdom, they would gain a corruption. Oh, if, one of, oh, if a building in your home kingdom is destroyed, you gain a corruption. Okay. Take that invisible north player. That's yeah. right. So that's why oh. we hang out in the players. We have another door opening. Oh, I don't know if you notice the pace is picking up a little bit here. I think it's going to happen on. Probably on my oh, side. Oh, there it is. All right. Yeah, Let's see. Is anything behind it? Oh, look at that. No skulls. Lucky. Is there any glyphs? No, no. glyphs. <laughs> it came out that one side. Open door. Oh, and the month has ended. So uh -oh. we're in month four now, yes? Yes. Whew. New quests. Uh, fire is below. The Astrider creates hellfire and sunken caves to destroy rivers from below. You can extinguish these flames if you reach their source. Quest in the muted forest in the north. And complete the Delves of the Lost Giant dungeon or rivers will be set on fire. Oh, Meaning that you probably uh, have to... I feel like to I forgot to take out the tokens for the dungeons, but that's fine. Uh... Yeah. The Dells or the... We'll oh, use... Let's uh, put the iPad over here if you don't mind. Oh, sorry, sorry. Right, I completely cool. forgot. So this is our first dungeon. Oh. Which uh, I can run over... Can you... Or can you grab yeah. the... Let me grab the box here. Gigantic box. The, uh, oh, fine, I'll take the whole box. Take oh. the whole box. All right. So the dungeons are special tokens. Uh... You never want to sneak peek of the insert as well. Yeah. I gotta tell you what, if I see a cave that has that kind of an entrance, it looks it looks very well the other direction. Okay. It's welcoming. Like, why wouldn't you go in there? No. So it's got tusks. Dungeons nice. got fire magic. Are they're sort of like drawn out battles where you resolve one room at a time. Okay. Oh shoot. I meant to do that. Yeah. That's a solid right. box, Justin. Yeah. Alright, so this is a uh, cave. We have one of each type of dungeon token. Here's the cave, and that okay. is in the muted forest in the north, which is right there, right? right. Nice. All right. All right. So the way dungeons work uh, is you go to that space and use the quest action to explore a dungeon. Mm. All right. And then I can show you how that works. But basically, you're resolving one room at a time. They're like mini battle cards. You can only spend one advantage per room. Ah. Uh, but usually, if you spend an advantage, you get something good. Like it goes from bad to good. Like the spread okay. is bigger. Oh, that's okay. awesome. Uh, but then you have to explore and try and find the room that you're looking for. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. So you're trying this case. There's some room within these caves where the fire is getting ready to blow up the rivers. You're trying to find that room in the dungeons. So. Okay, got it. And then we also have a recruit Tomas. Tomas uh, the scout seeks refuge for the common folk to hide safely while the menace of the tower looms. Help him finish his work. What? Tomas. Tomas, it Tomas is. Tomas lush, lush, long hair. He's got a Tomas. hat, Tom. No, he doesn't. Uh, <laughs> help him finish his work, and he's sure to join your ranks. Quest in Copper Grove and spend three gear to Copper gain Tomas Grove. as a companion. Where is Copper Grove? It's in the east. Oh, there it is. There it is. There it is. Uh, huh? Right there. Right here. Yeah. That looks exactly like Tom. It's a good likeness. <laughs> All right, so we got that. So we need three gear over there if we're going to do that. If it actually started like lifting up off the ground, I would. <laughs> I guess that sounds working because every time it comes on, it, it's getting attention. Yeah, nice. So we're we're still doing the sounds are in there obviously, but that's we're doing a lot of engineering on the sounds right now. And this awesome. an off switch, right? So it doesn't just think I'm a ping in yeah. the middle of the night. No. <laughs> right. um, no, no, it comes to life and it will. All right. So by the way, we haven't done this, but you're yeah. more than welcome to obviously see what Tomas does oh, okay. before you decide if you want to do Ooh. his dungeon. <laughs> Uh, and then uh, that was. Oh, he's whose turn was that? Advantage. That was Mike's turn. No, so Jay, you don't turn. need to spend spirit to double your move. Oh, and two spells. Eh, man. <laughs> I say man. You say so what's interesting? Tom is overrated, is what you're Tom saying. Tom is overrated, yeah, is what I'm trying what to say. What's interesting is that obviously he might not be that important in this but setup. Depending but in on the some scenario. other setup, he might be like oh, super incredible. important. For yeah. sure. And then of course, mm. every one of these. Uh, Allies can also be the main objective that you choose in the oh, game okay. oh, and have a com you know different objective. So, Very cool. Oh, right. Go ahead. All right. So I don't have <clears throat> I don't have spirit. I did my banner, uh, so I can only move to where you guys are. Mm -hmm. So I can't spend the extra spirit to get out of there. Unfortunately, um, one two. <laughs> I'm pretty limited on my movement actually. 
So I'm gonna... Wait, don't you have something that can move somebody, Roy, or no? I could move you three spaces if you needed to. Well, Look at that. Wait, can Teamwork. I use that at any time? Yeah. No, right. sorry. Oh, it has to be his turn? Oh, his turn. Yeah, I don't know why. I was could he move to the my space? Originally, thing? you could do that. What? Could he move to my space, get the item, and yes. then use it himself? That is true. Can that's, I give that's him... That's the way you can do that. Can I, you, can I give him any of my stuff when yep. I trade? You can freely trade anything you want other is than... Is it one person that's going to be fighting the bad guy, or we're all going to be fighting You can... Well, one at a time. Like, on your turn, you can fight the yeah. adversary. But once he's out, anyone can fight him on the okay. turn. Okay, so, so we've had we've got all four of the treasures, right? I've got I have three. He's got three. I have one. Oh, you do have one. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So if you come to my space, we have them all. The problem is you won't be able to move. Will you be able to get to us, do the trade, and then get back if I give you the plus three movement? I can get to the final quest. Like I could initiate the final quest. I don't see why we let's do it initiate as fast the as final quest. Brutal. I mean, what's the worst that could happen? You just lose initiate. The game. Final quest. Press the final quest button. That's right. I'm just going to stand Launch right it. here in the bazaar. Mission to control. Show my dominance. Wow. Right. How many how many bad guys have you fought yet so uh, far in this game? So one other thing to keep in mind is you will get a reinforce action this turn, obviously. So make sure you fit, factor in when you want to do that, if that's here or somewhere else. If you want yeah. to get a citadel. Well, what, or what was I add to that? I was at a citadel. You can also try oh, to get the... Get a potion. And you, you might even get like an extra three warriors if you... I might. <laughs> <laughs> I know he's... He's uh, got some traumatic <laughs> past with the haggle dice. Magic I love these. the fact that the first thing that Chris fights this entire game is going to be the main boss. Are you trading first, or do you not have any spirit? I have no spirit. He yeah. could not have less spirit, Roy. So, and you're going to have to use your main action to quest there, so you're not going to gain any spirit. I'm going to have no spirit until I quest, yeah. But I think it's worth it. So I'm going to come here. Uh, my reinforce action is going to be at the bazaar, right? I'm going to gain a magic advantage. Seeing as how yep. Mr. Ash Strider here is the right. uh, yeah, seems awesome. magician. Uh, money, please. Right. I will also give you the stepping. Now, should I keep this magic advantage or should I give it to him? Well, he's not going to be able to battle this turn because he'll uh, be using the quest action. Okay, but I'm going to hang on to my little. So you might want to brass talisman. Hang on for what you need to actually battle. Okay, so I've got. A, I'm I'm like Herbie. I'm fully loaded. Yes, yeah, so you got all have four more treasures. Than four oh, treasures so unless uh, well. Really? <laughs> Listen. So did, did, did Chris put like puns on his application to work here or something? I did not see them. I'm the one that's it's considered like old, and he's weaknesses. the one that's considered It's raining men and Herbie fully loaded. Like, Strengths. What I know lots you of jokes. In? Weaknesses. They're all terrible. <laughs> this is. All right. Spend and move three spaces. Uh, okay, so that goes potion. to the bottom of the potion deck. Mm -hmm. Brutal. Wait, people can have potions besides me? Oh, wait, I gave him that potion. That's right. All right. All right. And I initiate the quest. Okay, so you have uh, four of Azkal's treasures. You have five the unlocked sleeper has awoken. And you are in the wherever that is, right? <laughs> yes. The sleeper yes. has awakened. All right, it's Peaks happening. Of Main objective. Main objective. We're going to put it over even, here. Yeah, I was going to say, I don't even know what happens when you do that. <laughs> I like the way that sounds. Wow, you've never gotten this far. Now. Recover <laughs> Azkal's treasures. The treasure of Azkal, the sorcerer king, can be harnessed by the virtuous to draw the adversary from the tower. Bring them to Zyda. What was it? Zeta. Zeta. Zeta's sanctum. And they will complete the ritual. So since this ritual is a big come at me, bro. Yep. Quest yeah. in the peaks of the Jinn while you have four of Ascal's treasures and five virtues. Do you mind if I hold to complete, Chris? Hold to complete. Hold Get the finger bot. to complete. Oh, I wish finger we had a finger bot here. That would be fantastic. Ooh, we nice. win! Oh, wait. No, not yet. Okay. Zyda speaks words in an ancient tongue. A purple glow appears above Ascal's treasures. A violet ray shoots out of the tower! When the light fades, your nemesis stands bewildered, summoned by the effect's magic. Now take these treasures of Ascal and strike down the adversary! Effect, Ashstrider appears. All right, if you go to the next one, I'll tell us where. In, in Jewel Hills in the east. In the oh, east. over here. All right, there you go. So you couldn't up. actually make this shoot out of big purple laser beam? <laughs> Just, right. Listen, when we were first, uh, you know, spitballing, we thought of all kinds of wild <laughs> stuff. From there. We were gonna have the board vibrate, and the little laser beams, but actual wow, lighter yeah. fluid ravers yeah. of fire, smoke, smoke machine. No. <laughs> Here we go. All right, so you can, yep. And that's all right. So now that he is out, uh, oh, he's out. So you know, make no get, mistake, Jorah, he's out. Get to it. All right, two spirits. Mm -hmm. I just realized that was a pretty weak turn, Chris. Yeah, I'm I'm pretty disappointed what? myself. I'm gonna drop a skull into the tower. There. All right, 
Give that to him, you mean? No, I was supposed to have done that uh, last turn when I defeated the troll. I was oh, supposed to gain 10 think, people. Then gain 10. I mean, uh, it's a co-op yeah, game. Yeah, I was going to say. It's, it's I, fine. I, the reason I went to fight that troll in the first place was to do this. Yeah, That's yeah. fine. Okay. <laughs> you know, if that's what you guys asterisk. need to do to win. <laughs> Massive asterisk. <laughs> All right, rumor from uh, Astrider. Fires gather in the tower. Spies say the fires will rain down on a citadel. All right. Meh. Just, you know. Eh. Look, right. The buildings can all just crumble and fall. <laughs> you, guys, you all did a good job of uh, keeping your buildings pretty clean, so that's good. I'm telling right, you, Blessed another, Scepter's where it's at. Another uh -huh. door open. Teamwork on the Blessed Scepter was... It's right here. Oh, there it is. Oh. It's your turn, Mike. No, no, no. no I think it's your, it's your turn, isn't it? Listen, yeah. Chris went last. Listen, listen. I think he meant for whose turn it is oh, to get... Oh, yeah, I got two doors to open get now. To get scold. All right. As long as I don't get no. ruined. Yeah, the ruins are rough. I now All have right. a um, so we can Not a big deal, but we can remove that marker since that. Uh, yeah, the yeah, yeah, quest is now. Fallen. So we got to get over here to forward. this guy yeah. and fight him. We just got to. All right. Yeah. We Nobody need wants to. to do the dungeon? No, I want to. I mean, the dungeon's cool to check out. <laughs> primary objective. I feel like it's yeah, It looks so inviting. We'll, we'll save it for the next I, one. I'm just All worried. Right. Why did the Thomas ally bring the bad guy right beside him? Like, yeah, right? what is up with this? This is just shady. I'm a Shady business. <laughs> Shady business going on over here. All right. Uh, it's Roy, your turn, Roy. Punch him in the face. I guess I'm going to do stuff. I'm going to gain a potion punch first. Him in the I face. gain potion of a thousand strides. I can walk further. That's cool. So that means I can maybe just walk to him with that, or I can help somebody else get there. So I can go one, two, three, four, five. I feel like when I go against him, I'm going to get wrecked because I, I only have, there one, I have one magic advantage. So the other thing to keep in mind is uh, obviously you go in, each battle card that you can't complete is one corruption. You guys have. I mean, we got corruption. one early, but clean it up. You guys have no corruptions right now, so. Yeah, it's not a. I think where I'm we're at flipping over currently, five cards for this. Five cards, yeah. And, and going against him harder. counts uh -huh. as your. <sighs> but no, so I should let, let me stop. Sorry. You draw five cards. Mm -hmm. The important distinction I'll mention is now with the adversaries, you can retreat in the middle of. No, and now you're any, speaking my language. Any <laughs> any cards you upgrade during the battle remain upgraded when you go back when someone okay. goes back to fight them. What so about you can go in. Uh, no, they they don't level up. Mm -hmm. um, okay, they yeah. start at the highest level. <laughs> so any advantages so, that Roy spent oh, right, will make those cards yeah. right. advantage in the future. Right now, you might not draw that upgraded card the next time you go in, sure. but if you do, it'll stay upgraded. So here's oh, that's the thing: because right, you're drawing five out and of ten. And importantly, you could go in and say, "Look, I know I'm going to take a corruption because I have right. like nothing, but I have a corruption to spare. Just improve one card yeah. and then get out and get out of there." I think you just, you just described my next turn, Justin. <laughs> See, I could spin this to gain this, but then I'm not going to have any t when I'm going in to fight him. Yeah, but that's that's, that's a lot of advantages, really good. man. I'm going to do it. Do it. I have to spin both. So I have to spin. Normally, it only costs me one to get one, but because I have a glyph. the Literally glyph glyph. here, the glyph of I have suckage. to do it. So I spin two here. Mm -hmm. I'm going to get the burning sands scroll here. Um, what about the Lamp of Darkness, where and you can complete your lamp collection? I can give rid of a skull where I'm at, which there are none, which is lame. Um, and then I will um, walk over here using this to go three extra spaces. So I will go one, two, three, four, five. And this will go to the bottom here. And we will go for it. All right. Yes. All right. Fight, fight, fight. I, I guess we'll fight. see how far I can get. So hit the battle button. Select Astrider. I'm just going to see how far I can go and just die. So I, I do five cards. Yep. Out of eight. Oh, there's only One, eight. Yeah, two, there's only eight. Yeah. Which is good because Four, that means any cards with advantage are right. more likely to draw right. back into. What? Eight, eight skulls. On buildings in your current kingdom. That's great. How many skulls do we have over there, Justin? Uh, you have... Uh, Ten. So Fantastic. Now you can upgrade that. Of sure. Course. Like sure. What, what did we calculate your advantages? Oh yeah. How many advantages? I have. have it's magic ones, and beast, right? right? Yeah. So magic one, beast, yeah. two. Here's the. Uh, is this hills? Oh, okay. This is hills, right? It is hills. Yeah. It's so in your home, one, home two, kingdom. three, four, and then I have this, which could be a wild. And Zeta. And mm -hmm. I also have this. I can spend an advantage to get four magic advantages. And you can spend an amulet of the merits. You can you can go you can go pretty deeper. Let's so see I can how you spend do. this now. Or when do I spend this? Whenever you want to use them. But I have to save an advantage to end up getting three more, right? Say what now? This is spend an advantage to gain. Not spend. You spend that item. Oh, you spend it yeah. to gain yeah. four. So it goes away and you gain four. Okay, so I'm going to start using my free ones first, which I yep. have four free ones. Okay. So, so one, two, 
three, four. Do you want to use them all on this? Well, no. you can do them one at a time. See what happens. Yeah, you do them one at a time. How much you? Because this is just how many turns we're going to end up having. Right, right. right. Yeah, it's but probably going to go down to six. But if multiple of us do it and have to put out four skulls every time, and also it will destroy buildings. Buildings too, yeah. right? Is the other thing. And you remember, if one of your buildings right. is so destroyed, you're going to. So I'm going to use at least one on this because I don't want it to be eight. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. So we're going to do one on this. Five. Okay, I thought one six. Under five. So I could easily put out five. Yeah, look. What's the worst that can happen, right? We could just lose. Is that what you want? And so you have to compl You have to finish a card, yeah. and then afterwards you can retreat it. Right, so when you, you're you going to confirm the card, and then it's going to give you the option of retreat or continue. Mm -hmm. Cool. Well, I'm going to confirm the card, because this isn't okay. killing me currently. So, so you, we have to put five out there. Put five out before you... Before uh, you can confirm. confirm the card. But then, uh, okay, and then you next or retreat. Yeah. Got it. You like to spread it around a little yeah, bit. Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right, that's fine. You All want right. to go next? Or you want to run away? I'm definitely going next. Lose thirty warriors, one gear, and a treasure. <laughs> <laughs> so I still have three. Yeah, advantage, advantage, advantage. 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 <laughs> now, I yeah, have, no kidding. <laughs> now I have the sneaking suspicion that these are harder cards. So even if you advantage them all the way up. You probably yeah, you're not, not getting, getting, you're you're not getting, getting anything. I'm going to spend right. another advantage to just lower this. This goes down to 20. 20 and a gear. Which I could do, but it's going to be really hard for me to continue to go forward with that. If, you're, if you don't think you're going to do the whole gambit. Now it says advantage is spent 2 out of 10. Does it know how many? It like, knows how many advantages you're spending, and you can't spend more than 10 advantages. Got on it. Any that's what that is. Okay, okay. so okay. no matter how many you have, you can never go above right. 10. And the reason why that's okay. relevant is there is one of the adversaries, Utuku, the I'm gonna Ice do it again. lowers that cap. That's so this is just advantage. 10. So I'm just ooh. using 10 warriors. Okay. okay. Done. All Next right. card. Confirm. Yep, let's go. Bring it. Next. I'm going again. Yeah, let's go. 25, war 25 warriors and three spirit. I don't have any spirit. No, you don't. Um, but I can wreck this card a lot. Wreck this card a lot. Or, um, just pointing this out, you could just take that corruption, because you don't have any, and go to the next one and see if that one's, oh, wow. you can wreck that one. Like, you can just... Oh, I could just take the corruption. I can't do this card and take the corruption. Yeah, I think that's a good one. Because if I get through all five, the game's over. Yeah, if you if you confirm, if you're able to, oh, if you're able oh, to let's do the do last. This. Yeah, I'll take the corruption. Chris. Give me that corruption. Give, Give me that corruption. Me that old time corruption. Game ends. Okay, you lose. If you end your oh. turn on your home <laughs> kingdom, lose one of these. One spirit. If you, okay. <laughs> no thanks. Which although would give you a corruption. So okay. now, importantly, really hold on a second. I just want to point right. this out. <laughs> What's the Based, timing? If I beat him? If you beat him, you're good. But well, my point okay. is, if you don't beat him, at this point now, if you retreat, because you don't have a spirit, you're going to gain another corruption. So if somehow you were to gain a corruption on the fourth card and the fifth card, obviously you lose. If you gain a corruption on the fourth card and stop, you're going to gain another corruption because of that and lose. So now you might need to change your strategy. I just want to point that out. Yeah, but I also just did a quest action, so I'm going to gain two spirit after I did. No, you would... So, uh... You're right. So that's that true. That's true. Turn. That is a good point. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Ooh, point. Combo. Not okay. a quest action, a battle okay. action, but yeah. Yeah. Okay, so I still have one to use. I'm well, no, wait, no, you're I'm confirming gonna... this and taking that to confirm it, correct? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Next. I'm going to keep going, yeah. Each hero. Uh, no. <laughs> so there are cards. I didn't mention this. Uh, it's good to learn. <laughs> I didn't mention this. <laughs> but Some I don't think the there effect. are skulls adjacent to either of us. It's just Roy. Oh no, I, that, no, Chris has some adjacent to him. Right, Each so hero loses fine. 18 warriors. Oh, I do too. Am I? No, no, I no, don't. No, you're not next to these goals. So you'd have to lose 18 warriors, which you have. Yeah, you have plenty. So, um, so each hero loses wait, so 18 the... warriors for each skull, oh, each skull on their adjacent space. So look, I'm, some effects... I'm, we've, you picked the right guy, yeah, for yeah. sure. Oh, but actually, some effects do affect the other players, which is right. another thing to keep in mind when you're battling. Chris is okay with it. You are corruption. not, because you you'd have could to I lose... just take the corruption for this one as well? You could. Yeah, but if you can't complete the last card, you probably can. You have a lot of these yeah, conditional lot advantages. Of I, have, I still have. But to if the last five, card is six. like even lose one spirit, you're toast. Right. Because even if you advantage all the way, it might right. still be exactly. one spirit. Yeah. It's, it's 18 warriors for, for each, each skull. skull. Right. Yeah. So how much? 36. Is it? Well, no, he's only. It's 18 for him. No, it's, it's, he's no, got just two. one beside me. No, it's no, no, that's, that's, that's not him. Yeah. 
Oh, cool. So I could just be 18. How I could spend it. How many do you have left? Oh, you have your potions of uh, dragon. Yeah, he's got his potions. I have this. I have the potions. I have one. I have five that I haven't even, like, popped as what, far as How many advantages has he used already? Three. Okay, okay. so you got plenty of that. Yeah. That's fine. So I have tons of advantages. All right. You want to go for it? Like, should I just it. do the warriors? I'd say just you, use the warriors. Listen, I think we're all forgetting the most important question. What time is it? It is. <laughs> just kidding. Yes, that's okay. true. <laughs> I could use the warriors, right? Yep. Yeah, you can spend so, those right now, get 12, and then pay so for get that. 12. Yep. So I don't quite have enough, so I would take a corruption too. Uh, yeah. Okay. So, so are we confirming that card? I believe it? so. We're going to take this, right, as it is? Yeah, because then I could corruption to win. Wait, basically. but he's spending them. You're not. I, I you don't get a have corruption. enough. So okay, I so I do confirm. But you lose all that you have. So that too. is... I do. Okay. Okay. But I do confirm, yes? 15, yeah, and you, you lose all that you have. So 16, you're not 17, free. 18. And what corruption did you get? I am uh, what the kids call these days sus. Sus. Mm -hmm. I cannot carry more than two potions because I'm suspicious. Ah, uh, okay. Okay. It could be poison. You never know, Chris. Right. right. It could it's be. All right, here we go, Roy. It's all let's down to this. Let's do it. Let's next. Let's do this. Place eight skulls on buildings. Oh, this is nothing. Eight skulls on buildings in your current kingdom. Uh, yeah, but I can minimize it to yes. death. Yeah, but you're yeah. going to have to minimize it. I was going to say, because yeah, yeah. you right now, you can't okay. do that. We can do it. <laughs> I have one free one. I have one left, so I'm going to use that one first. You do it. Yeah, there's no reason five not to spend five. I'm going to spend this all right, so to get one more. So do it again. Three skulls. I mean, you can just stop there. And I could do this. One skull. <laughs> go all in, I mean, there's dude. no reason for me to not do this, no, right? Ahead, yeah. So I do that. All in. One skull. No, no, get rid of that. I still have two more advantages after this, though. No losses. All right. You did it. Is there a hit confirm? It's a very sad uh, you win screen right now. Next. Yeah. What? This needs to be the most epic part. Congratulations! <laughs> it's the <laughs> Dark Tower and its minions. We congratulate you. <laughs> Now we actually have this nice win okay. art and then some music. Why does music it say the this? dice tower? You've beaten the dice tower minions? No, I'm just kidding. Uh, <laughs> I'm just kidding. You guys did it. You won. Hey, Your first I see one. Oh, pretty mode. Chris, how many did you I defeat? How many did the brutal warlord? How many? How many fights monsters did you, did you have, feed? Chris? How many? How many of you? <laughs> Had virtues. I was the most virtuous brutal that is warlord true. in yeah, history. The, the, the only treasures. thing we need you to do was trigger the last quest. I think the one Just important thing we learned is that we need to make the game a little harder. Uh, no, 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 I'm feeling extra gritty. Well, that was fun. I love the combos. Yeah, the combos yeah. were this a lot was, of fun. Uh, this was good stuff. Uh, Justin, thank you so much thank for you. coming aboard and, and walking us through this brutal, brutal adventure and, and for uh, picking up Chris's slack. I very much appreciate it. Yes, thank you. Very, very good time. So. Return to Dark Tower. Yeah, I like Dark it. Tower. Coming out later this year. Uh, if you backed it, thank you very much. And uh, it's we'll keep everybody updated on how it's going. Yeah, everyone's awesome. excited about it. I think you can see why. So anyway, folks, thank you so much for watching. As always, the Dice Tower. I am Mike Delicio. I'm Roy Candy. I'm Chris Yee. And I'm Justin Jacobson. Have fun. Dropping skulls into very large dark towers. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs>